रायपुर जिंदाबाद गुड आफ्टरनून डॉक्टर समीर यस गुड आफ्टरनून सर हाउ आर यू जय श्री राम जय श्री राम ओके थैंक यू वेलकम वी हैड अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग डिस्कशन व्हेन इन द ओपनिंग सेशन डॉक्टर हेमंग गेव अस अ वेरी यूजफुल इनसाइट एंड ऑल दैट एंड वी आर नाउ लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू द सेकंड इनसाइट फ्रॉम डॉक्टर समीर तो यू विल बिफोर दैट प्रोबेबली यू विल लाइक टू गेट इंट्रोड्यूस्ड टू एवरीबॉडी दैट वी बेटर आई थिंक यू नो मी नो इंट्रोडक्शन नीडेड सिराम ऑफ कोर्स आई नो यू नो विघ्नराज आय नो सुब्रत सुब्रत करेक्ट करेक्ट यस नाउ ही इज इन द लिस्ट गुड आफ्टरनून सर आई एम संजीव फ्रॉम ओडिशा हाय गुड आफ्टरनून गुड आफ्टरनून टू डॉक्टर समीर फ्रॉम भोपाल सुब्रत हेलो हेलो यस यस वी कैन हियर यू सुब्रत सुब्रत ओके वंडरफुल टू मीट यू एज वेल सुब्रत वेरी नाइस टू मीट एवरीवन हियर गुड आफ्टरनून सर आई एम भूपेश कुमार भूमर फ्रॉम झारखंड रांची रांची या रांची सर आई एम पलक फ्रॉम छत्तीसगढ़ हेलो गुड आफ्टरनून सर सर आई एम श्रेया फ्रॉम मध्य प्रदेश हाय राजेश एंड सचिन आई नो सो सो आई एम ग्लैड दैट द कैमरा इज सो नाइस आई कैन सी एवरीवन एंड आई एम एबल टू रिकॉग्नाइज एवरीवन पॉइंट वेर आई रिली थॉट वी शुड रिली यू नो गेट इन टू सो इफ आई मे स्टार्ट सर yes sure okay so uh, just for those who do not uh, uh, who are not aware about me i am samir i work with unicef as nutrition specialist and uh, i have been working with unicef for last 17 18 years uh, uh, in different capacities and in different places and different regions uh, and and in different programs as well i worked in hiv i worked in health i worked in nutrition uh i worked at district called nandurbar in maharashtra where i started my journey uh and then i worked at state in maharashtra i worked for uh, for all the seven northeastern states as health and then also worked for assam for nutrition and then worked for 5 years in madhya pradesh as nutrition and then for last 2 years i am here in delhi so uh, so a little bit of understanding that i have uh, uh, from the different parts of india and on different aspects of food uh, health and nutrition uh, and based on that we i have been working closely with cfns team especially prusti sir when when we had met somewhere in uh, 2016 in in guwahati uh, yeah. assam uh, where we, where poshan abhiyan was recently launched and and uh, we started working on uh, on convergent action plans uh, in in few districts because it was mentioned in the in the document or in the guiding document of poshan abhiyan however what to do how to do where to do where to start whom to bring on board 
all those questions were not really answered in that guideline. And that's where uh, we had initiated some work in Guwahati, uh, in Assam, in few districts to develop this kind of a uh, convergent action plan. And uh, recently, last year, we started with this partnership uh, uh, in Delhi, uh, which, which looked at specific aspect of a program called uh, Community-Based Management of Acute Malnutrition. Uh, well, you must have heard about, I mean, you must have been talking about food and nutrition sector as a whole since morning uh, through different perspectives. Uh, I am going to talk a little bit uh, more specifically on, on, on this particular program uh, wherein we we kind of partnered with coalition uh, to, to, to really strengthen that program. Now, all of you uh, have been working in state for uh, at least for a month now, it seems, uh, especially with coalition, but you must have had a lot of experience in the past as well. Uh, this program, the Community-Based Management of Acute Malnutrition, uh, basically has two components. Uh, one, preventing malnutrition in the early life. So it focuses more on uh, uh, more on children under two or under three, you can say, uh, where we want to really prevent malnutrition through different nutrition-specific interventions that are provided by uh, by government, implemented by government functionaries on ground and, and monitoring the progress of growth of a child on a regular basis to see the effect of these prevention interventions. Now, if these prevention interventions uh, are not provided appropriately, adequately, uh, or there are uh, issues with regards to compliance to it, adherence to it, uh, growth is going to get affected because in the early, early childhood, you have fastest velocity of growth, uh, especially in the first two years of life. In Growth meaning weight and height or length changes or increase. Uh, and then if the interventions are not delivered properly, prevention interventions are not delivered properly, they, there is going to be this effect on growth. And just to see that effect, whether the growth is appropriate, we have to do a kind of a regular growth monitoring of a child. And and then uh, government of India mandates that at least monthly, every child should be measured for weight and height. Now, once you measure a child, you will come to know whether the growth is appropriate or according to the standards that are laid down to, to see the growth. Uh, and if it is not, then probably the child is slipping into malnutrition. And then there are different ways in which malnutrition is uh, kind of categorized, classified. Uh, we are looking at acute malnutrition, wherein your, uh, uh, your or a child's weight for height is lesser than the, what is uh, laid down as per standard. Now, if the child is, and that is called as wasting or acute malnutrition in, 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 in nutrition technical language, but once a child is identified as wasted or acutely malnourished, uh, then there is a need for an intervention to treat or to, to really take care of that child so that child doesn't deteriorate further and 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 uh, uh, and then uh, may, may not, should not succumb to the mortality or the death because of the nutritional status because there will be several diseases infections that will you know attack on that on that weak child if i would say in that in a layman's term so so that's the that's the program which is called as community based management some of these children might require hospital based care and and they are referred to something called as nutrition rehabilitation centers uh, uh, especially among the six states that we are dealing with uh, uh, madhya pradesh has around 105 115 uh, nutrition rehabilitation centers almost one third of uh, uh, of india's nutrition rehabilitation centers so not 115, I think 315. Yes, 315 out of 1,000 that we have across India. Uh, so, and then, and, you know, only 10% or so of children require treatment through these, uh, these hospital-based facilities. 
uh, risk can can be managed at the community level so that's a that's like broad uh, 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 program uh, that government is implementing in all the six states where you have presence however however there are several bottlenecks that that required to be addressed in order to really achieve the desired outcome of these programs and that's where uh, some of the bottlenecks are on ground but a lot of bottlenecks are also at the uh, at the at the level where decision makers or policy makers have to intervene uh, have to take certain decisions and that's where you know we kind of felt that coalition has a strong uh, presence and and and, and uh, uh, you know kind of liaisoning abilities uh, uh, to 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 really address those bottlenecks uh, so so point number 1 so far is there is a program on ground the program implementation is government's responsibility there are functionaries there are uh, 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 supply chains that are managed by government which are responsible for this program and and then there are actors which are which are really helping government in technical aspects to 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 improve upon this uh, capacities and service delivery of these programs uh, and those actors are like you you must have heard about these centers of excellence you must have heard about these medical colleges uh, then there are several uh, uh, development partners which are helping in technical aspects uh, to to really improve on the delivery now where comes the role for us and what are the bottlenecks that we want to really address so it's very important to understand the bottlenecks and and they are different in different contexts in different states and how do uh, you know understand how we really need to understand those bottlenecks and 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 find a way to address them and that's where uh, a, a bigger kind of a leadership role uh, that we expect or expect expect from uh, uh, from CFNS or coalition to play. Now, when I say leadership role, uh, it's it's more about you know bringing right people at right place uh, uh, to have a common kind of action uh, agenda uh, to address a bottleneck. Uh, and hence, uh, when you are working in your states, you must be uh, doing some mapping, identifying key kind of organizations, people uh, who are who are really important to uh, to deal with those bottlenecks. Uh, uh, and then to do that, we also need to understand the bottlenecks. And to understand the bottlenecks, we need to you know uh, again have a uh, a lot of idea or discussions with with those who are actually implementing it those who are supporting the implementers uh, to understand what challenges and bottlenecks that they are facing now if i if i just want to really say few of them on top of my head for this particular program very very specific intervention uh, 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 there is a huge uh, component of supply chain of medicines and supplements and 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 take home ration uh, which 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 uh, requires to be strengthened uh, to really achieve the desired outcome, uh, and that's where uh, a lot of these states are struggling. Number two, the kind of uh, food or a kind of take home ration that is being delivered for these children uh, requires a lot of enhancement in terms of energy density or even nutrient density. Uh, uh, again. Uh, a routine normal THR or a routine uh, food that is provided to all children might not be sufficient uh, uh, for these children specific children and that's where you know enhancement of a THR is something that is required again states are struggling why states are struggling we need to really deep dive into those aspects uh, to resolve those bottlenecks states are struggling because there is there is issue of budget probably uh, uh, because technically they know what is needed in those take home rations but uh, but probably additional funding that is required it's not there uh, and then uh, you know trying to get those solutions uh, through different uh, different consultations different mechanisms is is something that we can really look at as a role for us uh, 
at the community level everything is provided uh, uh, you, uh, you must be many of you must have been working at the at the community level if even if you provide everything it is not given that uh, that the family or the community will really adhere to it and do it as per protocol so um, compliance to the protocol at the community level or at the household level is something that is still i think a big challenge uh, again uh, bringing together all, all the you know cso's all the uh, all the actors which are working at the ground level and having a common kind of a message understanding among them is something that that a role uh, that we can really play these are like some of the uh, uh, some of the key challenges where we felt that the you know uh, cfns could address those bottlenecks uh, of course uh, 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 until last um, uh, last mid year mid year mid year 2023 or june 2023 uh, there were no national guidelines for this uh, this program so uh, states were doing it uh, we, uh, using their state specific guidelines and that's where again we felt that cfns could play a big role in in, in bringing together all the learnings from all the states uh, and, and and putting them together uh, into uh, into a kind of a document or a process uh, which will also inform the government at the national level uh, to to really think about this. However, that bottleneck is now resolved, but there is still a scope to really bring together good practices uh, uh, from these states to uh, uh, at the national level and and uh, really you know take them to Ministry of WCD for them to understand how different states are doing uh, uh, doing this program. Uh, differently in their context but still uh, delivering a lot of uh, good results and uh, services for children uh, three words that i uh, and that's where i started my uh, discussion by saying credit so leadership governance convergence and enabling environment these are like three four uh, uh, kind of words that come to my mind when i see coalition or when i uh, when i think about a coalition coalition is about bringing together right stakeholders at right place uh, and and channelizing their energies channelizing their uh, efforts into a into a common kind of a goal vision uh, and that's where the leader leadership and leader comes in uh, it's not about having expertise in the sector of food and nutrition uh, there will be several experts, but it's more about bringing together the key stakeholders and knowing them and 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 really identifying them uh, to deliver something. Sharing that credit, that's where I was coming to. Sharing that credit with this with those who are the key stakeholders, uh, and 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 making them shine so that the sector delivers. Uh, that's something that I think we should really be doing. Convergence, of course, is is key. Uh, we see a lot of uh, programs, a lot of uh, interventions delivered in vertical fashion. And even, even with my, uh, even with this program that I was explaining, uh, it's more about, uh, I mean, there are two key departments which are, which are there. Uh, one is WCD, which is looking at growth monitoring and, you know, providing kind of nutrition to these children. While other is health, which is looking at providing medicines as well as, you know, doing the health screening of these children. Bringing them together, bringing only two stakeholders together is, is such a difficult task. Uh, and all those who are working in the states must be knowing, uh, 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 you know, they will send letters to each other, but probably they will not come and sit for a coffee or tea. So, uh, uh, so that's a, that's the biggest challenge that uh, that's uh, that we really want we want to address. Uh, and again, uh, several people have tried several different ways. Uh, including uh, including high level committees established under uh, chief secretaries etc uh, uh, but really bringing it uh, uh, to the to the you know fruition or a clue uh, conclusion is 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 something that uh, that still is to be seen uh, and third word that i said enabling environment uh, again uh, everybody coming together should have some kind of a a common vision but also should have some kind of an enabling environment uh, uh, essentially meaning 
uh, that everyone feels that they are going to get something, gain something. Uh, 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 gain meaning, you know, they will it will benefit their own cause as well as a common cause. And and it will also help the communities. Uh, and then, and uh, again, that environment uh, typically in a government setup is is driven from a vertical kind of a thing, from a from a top to bottom level, and hence creating that niche at the at the at the at the highest office is something that uh, I felt uh, is 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 a bigger role for uh, for CFNS. Uh, of course, if I go into technical domain, then basically, you know, nutrition, food, everything is driven uh, by three kind of uh, things. One is like core technical knowledge. Two is about uh, the delivery mechanisms. And three is about a huge chunk of social, uh, uh, you know, factors that drive uh, uh, the whole scenario. And 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 really identifying technical, uh, sorry, uh, stakeholders in each of these domains and bringing them together uh, is something that uh, coalition uh, uh, has a role to play. Of course, there will be resistance. Of course, there will be players who will feel threatened, who will feel, who is this coming in now? Uh, uh, we are working here for so many years and now you have come here and you are doing something. So those kind of uh, things will also, you know, pop up. And that's where uh, leadership role comes in, you know, providing that, platform for others to shine, others to really uh, uh, get the credit, uh, but still reaching the goal that we, we envisage to reach. Uh, uh, that's something that coalition really has a, a, a kind of role or a kind of strength to, to, to really go forward. So those are a few kind of, uh, uh, I would say, a GAN probably. Uh, more of uh, more of generic. Uh, in our partnership, what we are probably intending is uh, I'll I'll, I'll uh, kind of spell it out a little bit. Uh, it's more about uh, uh, you know bringing together all the partners and 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 having a common understanding of the program that I am saying uh, that I I explained at the beginning, the prevention and management of acute malnutrition. I, I'm talking very very specific. Uh, because I uh, because I'm struggling with the results under that program. Uh, number two, addressing the bottlenecks under that program, and that's uh, that's where I mentioned about the take home ration, improving take home ration uh, uh, in terms of its composition as well as delivery. Uh, number three, bringing together health and WCD department on some of the issues that are uh, uh, that are uh, difficult to address in in this aspect in this program. And uh, number three, uh, number three probably is really identifying good practices, learnings from the ground, uh, and 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 bringing them uh, uh, on a common platform at the national level uh, 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 to really learn, uh, to really facilitate learning between the states, uh, so that they are able to really implement it uh, in a more effective way. I will probably stop here, and and see if we can have some interaction, some questions so that uh, we can unpack it further. Uh, thank you, Dr. Samir, for the interesting insight. Uh, this is definitely helpful. Uh, now I request our colleagues to um, seek clarification or raise questions as they wish, because they come with a varied experience from this state. Now, the couple of months they have started working on ground, so they have developed some understanding. So it would be good if you take some time to spend some time to listening, to listen to them, to hear them. Yeah, out, yeah. What they have seen. So some reflection from the state. Start. Who will start? Okay. Uh, first, introduce yourself. Which state you are talking? I'm uh, Sanjeev Naik uh, from uh, Orissa State, uh, State Program Officer. Uh, as uh, it is well known, uh, the uh, AFNS state structure is well connected with uh, UNICEF state team, and uh, uh, which is Sarah Bhattacharya's uh, nutrition specialist. 
and we have a good rapport with him. And uh, just would like to request uh, Delhi team to uh, to have a connection or uh, set up a connection with the sector of excellency so that uh, the coordination and the networking will be uh, happening in the state of uh, Odisha. Uh, specifically, I would request to set a connection or coordination with regard to uh, getting with the uh, activities that we are doing and they are doing. The share some, okay, that's your uh, demand, but mm -hmm. share some uh, good things about uh, Odisha or uh, experience from Odisha that you have visited various districts, you have very visited, met several uh, stakeholders, including the government uh, offices in the district mm -hmm. as well as the state, principal secretary, right from the principal secretary to the uh, deputy director. Um, and like that experience you share. Yeah, definitely, sir. Actually, uh, this is uh, privilege to talk. Sorry, can you hear me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, 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 sir. Yeah, I had lost uh, for a minute. Uh, uh, Connection. If you could just spell out what you wanted, uh, I just couldn't understand. So I was uh, saying that the, uh, in the state of Odisha, uh, it is my request to have a coordination to them. I mean, a communication or a setting up a uh, uh, coordinating CFNS to this uh, center of excellency. Facilitated, uh, facilitated. Connection with the Center of Excellence in Odisha, uh, that means UNICEF Odisha, CFNS Odisha, and uh, COE Odisha. Yes. So if uh, UNICEF head office can help, so because we are so still so. struggling on that front. That's not okay. Happening. Okay. So uh, we have, I mean, I can connect you with with UNICEF uh, Odisha team because I, even I am not uh, in connection with COE Odisha. COE Odisha is 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 part of UNICEF's uh, Odisha team's uh, kind of network. So. Definitely, I can you know connect with uh, uh, UNICEF team in Odisha, and then through them you can really re approach for that. Yeah, you can emphasize the importance of that because we have not been able to make you in a single meeting as yet. Sure, you. sure, sure. And then I requested Sanjeev to also share with you something more more useful, interesting because in the last, he is uh, the oldest SPO right now with how many six months? Seven months. Seven months. So she has he has visited uh, many development partners. He has visited uh, the, the government officers across the line, right from the secretary uh, WCD to uh, collectors and CDPOs and, and uh, like that. And uh, she has been he has been interacting with uh, other stakeholder departments like agriculture, uh, health, uh, and all that. So some insight if you can share, quick brief. Thank you, thank you, sir. Uh, in, uh, in a couple of months, in the seven, uh, I mean, seven months, uh, almost three to four times, I have visited the intervention areas, I mean, the districts like Parapur, Malkangiri, Navrampur, and Kandamal. And we to visit uh, Kyozor and uh, Balangir district. And uh, most of the uh, interesting thing I have uh, uh, observed from the field that uh, the respective uh, WCD department, uh, DSW, and CDPO, they are very uh, cooperative and some uh, interesting practices are going on like kitchen garden and nutrient garden are going on and uh, those are uh, capturing, uh, I mean, that, uh, that is documented well and uh, as a best practice it is uh, done in Odisha and uh, some of the most, uh, I mean, civil society organizations those who are working for food and nutrition domain in Odisha, especially like CUSD and uh, uh, Agrogami, uh, Udyama, and uh, this is Govindalai, Chagruti, Swati, those organizations are coming to the coalition group. And, uh, and most probably this, uh, within a seven month, a whole uh, number of civil society organizations have joined as a uh, member groups in this nutrition coalition. Other than that, also, I had also visited to uh, secretary from commissioner. Uh, Srimati Subha Sarma, uh, WCT department in the secretariat in Odisha. And uh, as, uh, as my uh, uh, team, I consulted with regard to how we can accommodate with the WCT department to work with the close coordination with regard to this DSR and SMT. And uh, I had a discussion with uh, Subha Sarma ma'am and uh, with regard to having a memorandum of understanding with the CFNS, how we can work in the state of Odisha. And most probably, as she assured me to consult with uh, uh, Ningaraj Panda, the ICE, 
uh, director. director of ICDS and social worker. And fortunately, uh, recently we had a program, Odisha Vikas Complete, which uh, pushed us for CFNS in the front page. So it was a good uh, uh, coordination with the WCD department, CFNS is building in Odisha. And most probably in the coming days, they, we will be The group. director also made a presentation. And uh, in the uh, Odisha Vikas Complete, uh, the director was invited. Of course, uh, secretary was invited, but uh, she had some engagement, and director came and uh, uh, he presented the entire scenario of uh, this uh, Ulsa state with regard to TSR and uh, supplementary nutrition provisions. And then uh, he promised me, and uh, last, uh, I think, two days back in 19th uh, um, January, there was a round table in Madhya Pradesh, and he was a part of this uh, round table, so he had to discuss with the best practice of community-based management of children active malnutrition. And then uh, we have a good uh, connection with the uh, Odisha Millet Mission and uh, ICR, National Rice Resource Institute, to collaborate with them and uh, have a connection so that closely we can work with the departments. So this is the quick update uh, that we have to see. Thank, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I just have one or two points for Odisha. Odisha has a fairly uh, uh, strong governance as well as, uh, you know, uh, program. Uh, uh, Odisha also has an augmented take-home ration uh, uh, mechanism for these children. Uh, and, and, and the program also sees a lot of fairly good recovery rate among the children. Uh, which is which is much lesser in other states, but in Odisha you see uh, sixty uh, more than seventy percent uh, kind of recovery rate. So there are some of the uh, good practices that must be there on ground, um, uh, not only at the level of Anganwadi center, but also at the level of community and and families, uh, which which would be worth exploring and and kind of you know identifying uh, uh, and and probably documenting. Uh, uh, to see how uh, you know how you have such a good recovery rate uh, uh, among the children. So, so that's something that uh, can definitely be uh, explored. Uh, in terms of uh, you know engaging with millet mission and 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 several other uh, aspects that you mentioned, uh, I'm not sure how you plan to really you know integrate it with this, but. Uh, uh, I mean that would require a lot of uh, discussion in within state uh, on on those aspects which are which are not really directly linked to this program, uh, but uh, what could be CFNS role on that? Uh, so those are few points on Odisha. Of course, uh, uh, you know a lot can be discussed with the team there uh, to take forward. Yeah, thank you. We have noted that uh, Madhya Pradesh. So, uh, regarding the bottleneck to be addressed during my visit to Nathanapuram, uh, I visited the Anandwadi Center, where uh, there were several challenges that were spoken out by both uh, the Anandwadi workforce and other community members, uh, the CDPO supervisors. So, what we did is uh, taking all the discussions that we had, we uh, made sure that our roundtable should be conducted and uh, to address these uh, bottlenecks. Uh, the topic of the roundtable was um, community-based management, best work practices of community-based management of daily management. And uh, we made sure to bring about uh, good practices from various uh, states, including Odisha. We uh, also connected with Maharashtra, Rajasthan, Telangana, uh, and MP. And uh, the government stakeholders, they presented their uh, good practices of the state. So there we have found that you know many bottlenecks that we are taking MP could be addressed through uh, adoption of good practices from different states. For example, supply chain management that we are facing in MP can be addressed through uh, the replication of Maharashtra models uh, that are uh, happening there. So this was the round table. I'm sure we can uh, bring about a document that writes all the bottlenecks that we have and what can be suggested to the interested government. And then talk about how can we uh, replicate the good practices from the state from other states. Yeah. So this is a quick uh, brief from uh, Madhya Pradesh. Uh, Shreya is only two months old, three three months three months old, and uh, she has. So, uh, 
so one of the biggest bottlenecks uh, in mp is is this uh, uh, you know take home ration enhancement uh, uh, everything is done the file is probably at the principal secretary's desk uh, 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 for further action and that's where you know if if any one of you can really uh, you know make a dent and 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 address it that would be useful uh, uh, and again, visiting a uh, field, visiting, uh, uh, doing things, I, I would suggest, you know, work closely with these COEs, with the UNICEF team, with other, uh, you know, members in the state, uh, because it's not about CFNS working, but it's about bringing all together. Uh, keep that lens always in your mind uh, uh, when you are, uh, you know, going to field or doing something. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, I think in Madhya Pradesh, uh, Dr. Samir, uh, uh, I think it is also a good opportunity to reflect upon uh, some of the issues where we left. You remember uh, when you were in the state, we had uh, initiated some very good dialogue uh, for the convergence between various departments. Uh, you remember the state nutrition policy uh, was also formed and all of us were together. But unfortunately, in last two, three years, there is no movement on, uh, you know, all these issues. So I strongly uh, recommend that, you know, the CFNS can also, uh, with along with CFNS and the other partners, like uh, we have been working together to bring this whole, uh, you know, governance in place in DWCD. So because this nutrition policy was a very big, big uh, you know, step uh, milestone for the state. But unfortunately, nothing has moved after the approval of the policy. So one area where I feel that, you know, it would be good that, you know, collectively, if we can bring little more uh, influence to the department and that brings uh, uh, convergence between the DWCD, health, ICD, uh, agriculture, horticulture, uh, even uh, the other uh, departments which we have listed in the policy under the convergence section. So this is one area I feel uh, we need to take it up. Another thing I fully agree with you that, uh, you know, CFNS team uh, can actually, we can do a mapping of uh, the most high burden pockets of, uh, you know, the districts and blocks where the malnutrition is very high. And maybe we can prioritize a joint visit with the partners who are working there to bring a first-hand kind of a status of THR and also the other services which are not getting delivered in uh, those pockets. So that was my suggestion because, you know, now I think we have 54 or 55 districts. I think a new districts are adding uh, every year we have new district. So maybe I think the prioritization to the most uh, vulnerable pockets or most vulnerable uh, uh, blocks and districts uh, we can start field visits, joint field visits, and also we can map who all are working there. So I was suggesting, uh, Shreya, that, you know, we can map all the development partners who are working in which pockets, and based on that, we can come out with a feedback strategy, like, uh, as you mentioned earlier, we used to do this, uh, you know, field visit sharing with the government. In fact, uh, you know, the last good experience I remember was when commissioner asked for a formal feedback from all the partners on what is happening at ground. So maybe we can bring that kind of, uh, you know, environment again. And I fully uh, understand the issues of enabling environment, which you talked about. And I, uh, I mean, I also uh, fully agree to, uh, you know, build kind of a more collaborative actions among the development partners to bring this enable uh, kind of enabling, uh, you know, environment around nutrition in Madhya Pradesh. So there is a lot of lack of communication at this point of time in the state. Uh, uh, we hardly have any communication among partners and also uh, with uh, so many other new sta uh, stakeholders who have come to the state now. So maybe we can begin, uh, CFNS can actually uh, begin uh, this communication. Maybe we can think about more active WhatsApp group, or maybe we can think about more uh, creative communications among ourselves. So uh, that will really help. And collectively, we can also start bringing convergence uh, in the state again. Absolutely, absolutely. 
माय ओनली कन्सर्न इज देर इज ओनली वन श्रेया आय डोंट नो हाउ मच सी कैन रियली स्ट्रेच हर सेल्फ टू या या एक्चुअली डॉक्टर समीर श्रेया इज आई थिंक शी इज नॉट अलोन नाउ वी ऑल आर विथ हर and uh, we uh, this idea of which uh, dr pusti will be sharing probably with all of us this idea of uh, having a, a kind of a host uh, support organization or a team to you know support uh, uh, the cfns team it's a great idea and you know uh, i think maybe in today's and tomorrow's meeting cfns will also help us to uh, you know finalize or a kind of a develop a collaborative action plan where others can also support cfns so like in madhya pradesh uh, uh, whh has uh, agreed to support uh, cfns uh, in uh, whichever uh, uh, way we can actually support right now we do not have much uh, uh, infrastructure facility like a big office or a conference hall but we have a strong will to support cfns uh, in bringing pe people together bringing organizations together and we have a, a strong commitment for uh, the nutrition security in the state so we are with uh, shreya and uh, i am sure uh, all of us together will uh, make a strong impact in madhya pradesh in coming days and of course you are there uh, pushpa is also there and we have uh, lot of backstop i mean backing support in terms of the technical uh, insights from unicef always so we will look forward to your and pushpa's support uh, in a more rigorous way in coming days yeah uh, ibet samir sure sure thank you very, very i was there in bhopal i spent uh, the day uh, and uh, we are a very unicef has a very active team in bhopal pushpa is full of energy and uh, pushpa was uh, absolutely engaged in the discussion throughout the day and she was making very very valuable uh, contributions in terms of ideas and process and all that so you have left behind a strong team in bhopal uh, uh, that's what uh, probably pratibha ji was is, was uh, uh, repeating uh, and uh, the, the the big gain uh, in our strategy is that um, we have a single person office one person office in the state but we have a team working in the state because our members and our host agencies uh, and they are mentoring the say, state program officer continuously is a big um, leveraging strategy in fact uh, in 3 months what shreya could develop uh, the part the kind of insights shreya could develop uh, in madhya pradesh is remarkable and that could happen only because of the contribution from uh, your uh, unicef's office in bhopal and active engagement of uh, uh, pratibha ji and his colleagues and his partner organization on ground that's the beautiful thing that has happened in madhya pradesh right right thank you over next who anil was uh, anil from telangana uh, like uh, thank you for explaining the expectations of the csn idea i think uh, the expectations of the national expectations of unicef of the unicef from from the CFS. CFS. yes okay unicef from the csn the expectations of the national team are somewhere not aligning with the state team or what i can grasp from the interaction i think that there, there is a communication gap that uh, what csn is going to do with the unicef in this project if that is conveyed clearly so our work will be easy that part i would like to ask so that is the whole purpose this exercise since morning you have been yeah, trying yeah. to that, do that i'm testing it out again yeah. so that but, is uh, so your your so your observation during the how many months to you two and a two two and a months spent in uh, telangana yes. this yeah. is his uh, quick uh, impression that there is a lack of uh, uh, coherence or alignment with uh, what the uh, central office meaning what the program is intending to do and the what uh, he is supposed to do that coherence was unable to find so that process uh, uh, this 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 has been communicated by the host agency and uh, our interaction with anil that has come out and we are working on that and hopefully within the next couple of months this thing will, will uh, uh, iron out and um, Uh, he will i'm sure he will come out as a champion of uh, a, a much more aligned uh, national office and state office and uh, and uh, unicef and development actors 
uh, he went to the UNICEF office. Also, why don't you share your UNICEF office experience? So it, it, it was for a review meeting I attended uh, of the SSF rescue program where uh, technical bits were much discussed uh, how to improve the application to track the um, program and all. So more, uh, in that in that meeting I uh, I met the ICDS staff and the CEO staff and everyone. After that, uh, you know there there were multiple factors in this as well. There was the government chain and. Uh, a lot of things are happening, and uh, this 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 miscommunication was there from the beginning. I was trying to figure it out how to, I don't know, but uh, uh, that ro role is not clear with the UNICEF country. So, the, what she was trying to tell us, um, Samir, uh, that uh, UNICEF was expecting that what you are supposed to do uh, when you was going to the government, what you are supposed to do, we do not know that, that what is the communication. You know, that kind of question, so I was. Uh, a bit of demotivating for uh, Anil. In fact, Anil, at some point of time, uh, on a very personal basis, his supervisor uh, called me up and said that our guy is feeling demotivated and he is seeking a chance. So in fact, that was very, uh, very not a very happy thing. Uh, and then we, I assured him, and I assured his boss also that we'll rework on this and we'll make sure that alignment takes place and better understanding is put in place. So that will be doing that. So this, uh, I'm, I'm happy that he is making this honest uh, feedback open. Uh, no, no bad feeling about that. Uh, I think we should take it in positive spirit and walk towards solutions. Right, right. Uh, in fact, uh, you know, every state has kind of a different context. Uh, again, for Telangana, the, the program is quite ahead in Telangana. I am talking about the specific program. I am not talking about the overall food and nutrition sector. Uh, uh, I am talking about the SSFP program that is, they call it in Telangana, uh, wherein, uh, you know, you have very specific Balamrutam Plus and, uh, uh, and, and a lot of things that are done well in Telangana. So, again, my suggestion is find out... Uh, uh, Find out the bottlenecks, understand the program and see where are the bottlenecks. Uh, not on ground level, but at, at a higher level where, you know, everybody is stuck. And, 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 and then we see how we can really develop that plan to address those bottlenecks. Uh, uh, rather than, I mean, uh, you, can, you can go into the depth of the program and, uh, you know, be part of several meetings. Uh, but every meeting may not have action for you or you may not be really support everything that is happening on ground. Uh, like, for example, you mentioned about some app or something, uh, which must be a routine thing that, they, uh, that the state government is doing. And you might not have any role in there. Uh, but definitely look at bottlenecks where, uh, where you know, state is struggling. Uh, and that's where we can play a role as, uh, as a coalition. Yeah, I think you rightly said that we should do a dipstick analysis of the bottlenecks in Telangana program to find out where we synergize, where the CFNS comes in alignment. If we go from outside and try and address something that, that all the actors in the state already present are addressing, there is going to be a resistance and there is going to be questioning that what are you doing, why are you doing. Everybody feels threatened. Even if somebody comes tomorrow and sees my boss in the morning and talks about my area of work, I will start thinking about it. That's how human beings work. Correct. So again, leadership. Leadership means I am not there, but I am there for you to support. Yeah, good, good. So that's the right uh, way to yeah. pick it up. It's a bit difficult, uh, especially if you are you are in the area. Samir, Dr. Samir, it's absolutely doable. We'll, we'll, we'll make this situation turn around. Next. Jharkhand, Ranchi, introduce yourself. So, मैं भूपेश और मैं झारखंड रांची से बोल रहा हूं और हमारा एक्सपीरियंस बहुत अच्छा रहा है झारखंड में स्पेस के लिए काफी अच्छा जो भी मंथली वाइज जो भी वहां पर रेटिंग्स हो रही है और वर्कशॉप हो रही है उसके एज ए सीएफएनएस को इनविटेशन आती है और प्रॉपर ट्यून करके हम लोग को 
सारी इंफॉर्मेशन का शेयर किया जाता है अभी तक अच्छा एक्सपीरियंस रहा है किसी भी तरह का प्रॉब्लम जिसे हम उसे शेयर करते हैं उस पर वो देखते हैं और करते हैं और हमें अच्छा सपोर्ट वो बिल्डिंग हो चुका है लास्ट टू एंड हाफ less than a month not a month 10 days our uh, latest because we had a turnover the previous uh, spo resigned and then uh, we had to go we and were lucky uh, we have got uh, madam here on my job right now i tell you only i you introduce the process छत्तीसगढ़ and move forward uh, in chatisgarh uh, in chatisgarh again uh, uh, the program is well structured uh, and and uh, in fact it is now uh, at a bigger scale uh, several districts have been added to it uh, of course there are i mean uh, there are bottlenecks with regard to take home ration again in the chatisgarh uh, which we are uh, kind of trying to address Uh, aparna has in fact worked with closely with the department to to get the recipe of a enhanced thr endorsed and uh, and in fact then there was a there was a change of government that happened in uh, last month or so uh, uh, but they were expecting that once this change uh, kind of settles down uh there will be there will be a endorsement or there will be a guidance uh, issued from the state level for enhanced thr so that state again is is at a very close uh, kind of a juncture where they can achieve that uh, big deliverable or big target so so you, uh, i mean you have a fertile ground there not really to worry about it uh, and you can hit the ground running so that's a good encouragement i think aparna is a good yeah. person you can stir and you have got a issue to handle direct readily thr issue in the augmented thr and thr issues maybe the supply chain issue maybe production issue maybe the recipe issues whatever it is you try to get into so you know a problem on hand straight you know you don't have to go for diagnosis and all that so attack the low hanging fruit then try to discover the other things good thank you Malak. the only suggestion is uh, you know uh, enter into a conversation understand from people uh, where are they and where are they facing challenges and then try and address it rather than i am here to improve your thr let me do it uh, if you say that then there is going to be a stepping up you know stepping on each other's toes and then of course pain it be because of that next last कौन बचा राजस्थान राजस्थान से 
हाँ जी मेरे दस दिन पहले मुलाकात हुई है Said some big issues. What are the big issues in Rajasthan, according to your observation, and during uh, whatever time you have got? You yes, yes. I am going to the third month. I am going to the third month. I am going to the third month. So big issue. I have visited the field. So overall, I saw that the T H R was very poor. It was very poor. And the T H R was proper stone particles. Uh, मैं बेनिफिशरी से भी मिला तो उन्होंने कहा सर हम इसे खा नहीं सकते खाते ही नहीं और डिप्टी डायरेक्टर से मैंने बात करी तो कहा कि देखिए राजेश जी हम लोग लिखते हैं दो तीन महीने तक ठीक रहता है फिर आई हो जाता है कोई शोन वाला ये ज्यादा दिन से चल रहा है बड़ा कंपनी को दे दिया मेरे को लगता है So, Samir ji, some very serious issues in Rajasthan. No, of course, but uh, I mean, addressing them is working closely with them. Mm, yeah. uh, uh, we, unless and until we, we decide that we are activist and we'll stand against it oh, and we'll have a code PIL or something like that, that is not going to work. So, we are not activists. Yeah. So, we'll have to really, uh, you know, work closely uh, and you know, give this feedback, improve upon it, and and make a system uh, for that. Uh, that's something that that is the approach that we take as UNICEF also. Yeah. So, uh, so these are interesting tips and interesting uh, observations. Uh, any anything else you like to hear from us? No, I think this was this was quite good. Jate uh, jate, uh, only two three suggestions. Uh, work closely with team there. Uh, always think that I don't know everything. Uh, there are a lot of people who are there who know all the things, and and I am learning from them. Keep that attitude so that you know people will welcome you. Uh, always resolve some of the problems. It's very important. If you resolve some of the problems, then then your value increases. Mm. Uh, not only going and talking and getting some data and, and then running away. That kind of approach will not help. Uh, try and address, understand their problems and then try and solve them through through your uh, uh, you know seniors like Prusti sir or uh, uh, you know Sri Ram sir or, or 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 there are several you know uh, uh, kind of. Uh, officers who have who are part of cfns who have worked with the government system uh, involve them based on your bottlenecks and problems that you identify in the state and resolve them uh, uh, so that you know uh, uh, you are able to really function more effectively there uh, so that's something that i would say uh, uh, is a is a way forward and of course uh, uh, what in in 2024 since you all are there in the states uh, we could even look at uh, having come some state state specific actions uh, uh, that we can take forward rather than having a generic kind of uh, plan of action for CFNS. 
uh, because some states are quite ahead. Uh, uh, like for their example, Telangana, Odisha, they are they are quite ahead in terms of their implementation. Uh, then there could be some different action or different role CFNS can play there. Uh, some states uh, are 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 quite behind. There you might have a different role or different action. So we could also look at. Uh, chalking out that as part of our plan for 2024. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, Thank it's you. an excellent idea to uh, identify state-specific key action areas and uh, prepare for it. And um, from my side, only one point that um, I personally feel that our engagement with this UIs has been very, very weak. And uh, I request that to the extent possible, you try to intervene. And we are also also making our efforts uh, to intervene. We found that the central COE do not have much ability to influence the state COEs. That's one thing that came out. And state COEs are typically government department, and they are also not being easily influenced by the, the state UNICEF team. Mm -hmm. So that is one observation that's coming. So how to handle that difficult animal is to be seen. Uh, that, that's a weak area in, in my observations that our engagement with the, the development partners. So just to give a brief uh, idea, a National Center of Excellence at the Kalawati Saran Children's Hospital is a completely technical body. There is no hierarchical relationship between national and state center. Uh, it's only there for providing technical inputs, very, very specific technical inputs. Uh, state centers of excellence do have partnership with uh, UNICEF offices in the respective state. Uh, and then those are uh, typically medical colleges, uh, uh, either AIMS or uh, state government run colleges, except for, uh, I think, uh, Odisha, which is, which is, which is again a hospital uh, under state government. Uh, uh, how about in your, terms of, how about your joining? some field visits in the states. I think you had indicated an interest also. I'm Absolutely. I'm uh, that, to do that. Sure, sure. Uh, that is one area. Number two, I, I, I also have a suggestion that th there is a COE meeting that happens every month. So all these six state COEs along with the national COE, uh, they meet every month uh, uh, virtually. Uh, maybe I'll I'll see how we can uh, you know also get CFNS participation in that meeting, uh, and maybe also uh, let's take a challenge of CFNS uh, presenting in one of the month uh, uh, about what they are doing and 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 getting a lot of questions, inviting a lot of questions on ourselves, uh, uh, but uh, but also trying to enter the space uh, through that process. Uh, we can also try try to do that. Good good. So those are interesting okay. uh, suggestions, ideas, and all that. Uh, anything from the central team you would like to hear? Yes, just I would like to mention one comment here. Uh, uh, very uh, uh, our, our state team. There are a lot of advocacy pieces already coming up as an action point uh, for state. Uh, sorry, yeah. for the to take up as an action plan for states. <laughs> If you can speak a little loudly. I'm hearing all the team members from the state. Uh, it it like a lot of action points are emerging as an advocacy tool uh, to the states. That's what I'm saying. Where we can have a lot of other stakeholders can participate to take it forward. These are all Absolutely. Okay. As, a, as a group, uh, as, as a stakeholder, members can address these issues. That's my point. Absolutely, absolutely. And in fact, we can break it down uh, for the states uh, and have state specific ones uh, listed for each state. And then we decide how do we take it forward them, on them. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. Dr. one good thing came up before your session, our interaction with our members, because we're also trying to map the members' expectation. Uh, one idea came that uh, at the state level, there has to be a working group discussions. So that 10 working group uh, that has been identified, so our state program officers also take initiative to hold that kind of thematic discussions to uh, identify, identify issues, um, uh, get an impression about the possible solutions, and getting engaged with the various actors. 
so that uh, came out so that will probably help our uh, going ahead in our program also sure 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 okay so so thank you very much thank you very thank much you. again and look forward to seeing some of you in the field wherever whenever possible yes yes oh, sure, sure. sure. Okay. 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 Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. If you want, you can take a five ten minutes break hmm. and then come again. Okay. <laughs> they, need, <laughs> they need a biological break and all that. So. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, second is coming as Nutri Gardens. Third, uh, even though Pratiba at uh, New York is trying to do something in MP also to push merit programs, particularly in MP, uh, also in particular. So we agreed that we have a conference, state conference, and we have discussed with us, but he could not say for us. Partly maybe because of the elections and all those things. And coming to Rajasthan also, uh, there are a lot of challenges. Uh, in the states, so uh, but it's a very new government. All sorts of new people have joined. Whole the entire set is new. The all minister doesn't have any experience. The CM is from Bharatpur. Same also in the first tenure. Also. Fast, fast, fast. People have joined the government. There will be a lot of dust. There will be a lot of challenges to to around the state. Probably. Also the budget. So when we discuss the budget PA, budget in MP, 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 मैंने बता दिया कि आपके डेटा में ये चीज नहीं हो रखी है स्टेट के पास बजट है नहीं वो हमारी प्रॉब्लम है देन व्हाट हैपेंड इज कि जब हम लोगों ने ओडिशा मॉडल देखा था तो ओडिशा मॉडल इज लाइक उनके ब्लॉक लेवल पे टीएचआर बन रहा है हमारे ब्लॉक लेवल पे नहीं बनता तो अब ये है कि एमपी अगेन बिग स्टेट तो उसने प्रॉब्लम ये होता है कि जहां पे देवास में जहां बन रहा है उसके डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिंग में जो कैंप चल रहे हैं से वन लाख स्टूडेंट आर कैंप इन एमपी उसके डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिंग में जो अपना एस्टैब्लिशमेंट है थिएटर एस्टैब्लिशमेंट उसके उसमें भी सिर्फ सेवेंटी थाउजेंड बच्चे आते हैं लेकिन उसकी प्रोडक्शन कैपेसिटी भी फिफ्टी थाउजेंड तो द प्लांट वाला इस सेइंग कि मेरा तो नुकसान ही हो जाएगा सर तो डेट इस अगेन एन इश्यू जिसकी वजह से हम थोड़े स here, uh, the market, uh, the, the, the commercial actors will, all, will, will always tell that give the order. Bigger the order, better the viability, better the profitability, so I have an interest. Chota kam karna, they are not interested. But Hamara to bring the uh, local context and uh, uh, the local food, um, we want uh, decentralized smaller models. So, you have got to experience of both centralized model and decentralized model. You have got an absolute centralized model like Rajasthan, where it is completely outsourced. Where you have got a semi-centralized model like Madhya Pradesh, where you have got several, we have got few, not one, few. But 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 all all are private actors or SAGs. In Madhya Pradesh, the all these states are producers. You are correct. Initially, it was with the MP Agro, which, MP Agro, which has they have taken the large scale manufacturers to make mm. it. That is how it started. Mm. Uh, I I don't think it's a decentralized thing. Hmm, it's not. No, so, it's not decentralized. It's uh, mostly it's centralized. Yes, but in different places. And whereas in Odisha and Jharkhand, it is a completely decentralized model, which is. But then quality control is the issue. Absolutely. Who is in concert? Both of them. But is the quality really good? I mean, if we centralize, can we can people vouch for the quality? So actually, it becomes basically an enterprise model for the entrepreneur. He wants certain 
quantity and order and all that, so he can make money. What is the quality and all Hello. that? Hello. Yeah, Pradeep yeah. madam. Ah, uh, yeah. Actually, sir, uh, uh, regarding this uh, THR issue, uh, in Madhya Pradesh, uh, there is a whole issue of uh, you know political commitment and advocacy also. So, you know, like, uh, are we, uh, I mean, we do so much of groundwork, study, uh, teams are collecting information, uh, we are trying to come up with some suggestions or, you know, um, recommendations. But, you know, at the top, you will, you will find that there is a lack of political will for such change. So all our efforts goes into, you know, circle. So uh, my humble suggestion is that, you know, THR is a very uh, politically driven agenda in Madhya Pradesh, particularly at this point of time for many, uh, I mean, there have been several models tried out in last 10 years, but ultimately the political political decision making has uh, influenced all the, you know, whatever model or whatever you call it. So uh, my, uh, the point which I wanted to bring it here is that, uh, uh, this requires a lot of advocacy at the policy and political level to bring change in THR. So are we uh, making some plans to do some, uh, uh, you know, legislative, you know, uh, uh, advocacy or are we thinking about uh, doing some very strategic, you know, advocacy at with the political leaders, then we should actually uh, get uh, our energies into it. Otherwise, what will happen, we keep on doing studies, we keep on doing uh, all the information, but at the end, the government will do what the government want to do. So this is the situation. So, uh, I mean, uh, we can do more uh, uh, useful, uh, you know, uh, pieces uh, in terms of uh, looking at the nutrition security for children. So this was one suggestion I have. Uh, if we take the uh, advocacy mode, then we need to really have more uh, collective efforts of all the partners and the, uh, you know, network civil societies and all the development partners. And it can be a very strategic move to influence uh, THR. Because in MP, uh, you know, Clinton Foundation used to support uh, a big initiative for THR. But unfortunately, that was not successful. In fact, there was a complete team uh, they deputed uh, to support the government. So maybe uh, we can learn from those experiences also because uh, getting into THR directly uh, may not be that effective in Madhya Pradesh. So this is my uh, suggestion. Right, that you are very right. In fact, I've been involved with this um, supplementary nutrition program for decades. Uh, my mm, uh, understanding also tells me the same thing, that it is such a politically driven issue. Uh, unless... Uh, 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 you have got a strong uh, influencing ability um, on the political system uh, and uh, strong technical no. demonstration of a successful alternate model. So that those are the two things. So we have to work on both fronts and this is not the time to just do its uh, very uh, superficial understanding and uh, superficial analysis or ad hoc analysis to go and promote pro, pro, support to one model or the other. We have to work on the, the quality aspect. We have to work on the cost-effective aspect. We have to work on the why this, why not uh, the other kind of thing. But is that looking, uh, sorry, sir. No, then the, the other thing is that uh, uh, I was thinking aloud uh, that working with uh, NIN, uh, uh, because NIN has developed that Bala Murtam Plus in Telangana, uh, which they say that it was successful, but then on rollout, uh, what happened that need to be seen when because as a, as a more technical model, it was good, but when it was rolled out in the state, how it's uh, what result it's giving and all that, and how that model can be decentralized and can be made state specific because what a, what works in Andhra Pradesh, Telangana may not work in Chhattisgarh. So how the similar things can be developed in Chhattisgarh or Madhya Pradesh and uh, is to be seen. And roping in NIN into this game will be a, probably a, 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 a magic stick for us because NIN is a national institution and they are, suppose they talk about something and they uh, present some analysis. 
probably it will be easy to sell. And uh, the coalition leadership will be very happy to promote uh, this, this idea. But before that, we need to get convinced that, yes, this is the best practice. So we have to work on the THR very deeply. There are, there are two issues. One issue is most, most of the cases we have seen when any take home ration is prepared or managed by the SLGs or small groups, there are quality issues. But most uh, in real scenarios, if it isn't organized by, I have seen so far, the Telangana boards made by Telangana boards, very organized structure, all facilities are available. Yes, uh, quality uh, quality compromise is not there. Good standards, good quality. Done by who? Telangana I have seen, I have seen hmm? excellent. Agro, Telangana agro. Telangana foods. Foods. Telangana foods. foods. And uh, was it was actually owned by government of uh, Andhra Pradesh. Now it moved to Telangana. But uh, nevertheless, they supply to both the states. I don't know that it's recent scenario, but earlier they... But again, we are talking about is a centralized model, no? Centralized oh, model. It really worked very well in Telangana, I have seen. But, but organized supply chain, we don't, we don't work in UP, we don't work in Rajasthan, we don't work in MP also. Mm -hmm. So, let's take an example of Odisha. The entire program is managed by the SAG. SAG yeah, it works very well. Doing very well, yeah. So, so there are there are examples. There are examples, there are pros and cons. We have to really evaluate, you have to look at. Uh, probably if you're talking about the alternate model, yes, uh, maybe in small scale, but you have to have all the facilities available. Uh, so that the, is another model you can pro probably propose. Why I'm telling you because recently visiting to the Rajasthan and looking at the uh, the what is called FBOs, FBOs can create very good infrastructure. But they, need, they are not technically sound. They need to be guided by an expert, maybe a food expert, sorry, a technical food technologies should be there. And they can handle those productions. Unless you have that thing, system in place, there will be quality issues. So that's, that's my point. And that, that, that's why I'm bringing in the element of NIN partnership, NIN collaboration, NIN partnership. But NIN collaboration can give you the quality. They can technically, they tell us the these, these things are required. Are but so what is compromise is what quality you buy, how you make it, all that thing are not saying. So they can tell you that uh, come, listen, listen to quality. Me. Listen to me. Yes. So NIN is a technical agency. It will be the manufacturing, uh, efficient manufacturing. No, they are, the, no. They, are, they are not efficient manufacturers. They can okay. tell you what kind of so, food it is. They can analyze the food. Okay. So manufacturing, you have to talk about the, not their okay, Then we can, okay, then we can talk shape tear right? Yep, 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 So if you conceptualize something that NIN knowledge, CFTRI manufacturing process, and a robust supply chain. Because that will bring, because I remember my days, uh, we worked with a uh, supply chain system with mother, yeah, modern foods, uh, modern foods which are taken over by Hinsan uh, Unilever. And the system worked very well. And those days, only Panjeri was. And UP was the only state which was giving Panjeri. Everywhere they're giving, the, distributing it like that. And this was the most efficient program in Panjeri, in, in supplement nutrition program in those days. I'm talking about these. So creating a efficient system probably is the solution. But that needs a lot of work. So think about that. Really? Actually, what you are describing is something similar to what is there in MP. The only thing is the organization which is given this task is not doing it you know, rightly. Yeah. So the dubious organization, they are doing for dubious purpose and all that. No, that is a, Otherwise, it's exactly the same. No? Had that organization been an efficient one, probably a committed one, with a value-driven organization, like data and all, huh? things would have been different. Otherwise, hardly a difference between this model and that model. But how do you bring in that? I mean, I don't think the answer is that, you know, you give them technical, the processing, nothing, that will not happen. It requires a certain set of people who are committed and actually drive it. So political will is required. And even this private fellow can actually be straightened. If the political system gets, you know, tough with him, he will deliver. Why not? But then if the system at the top is lanky, you know, probably they look for some other things, you know, uh, than really the quality food getting driven, then who can help it? When I started my uh, wheat, wheat particular program in, uh, in Haryana, uh, we approached to the chief secretary, we approached to the food secretary, nobody is interested because they knew that uh, there is a dark hole. 
mm. the Indra PDS system. Nobody wants to touch that. Then the moment I approached the uh, chief minister of the state, uh, when I met Mr. Khattar, I, uh, I convinced him, see, this is how it's required. We did a very high level advocacy. And he brought all the secretaries, why not they are doing it? Let us try it. Even uh, we tried with the Hafet. Hafet is a very rotten operation. Hafet, we worked with the Hafet. Hafet is a fantastic uh, positive facility. We worked with them. We have got stimulus such as nothing has happened wrong as, uh, as far as quality parameters. It is going on in five districts. Now we are proposing it for the whole state. The entire previous system is called King right now. So it is possible. But we have to have those kind of team working together and of course to the chief secretary and the chief minister. You'll never know who actually would be interested to make some reforms in the, in the food system. Depends on the leadership, definitely. Yeah. That's true. That's, that's actually true. So <clears throat> you'll find some CCM is very interested into this, uh, some certain reforms. Somebody may not be so interested. No, yeah, political system is not interested. Political system is more interested in that. Uh, yes, is, is more, it should be durability uh, of per, permeable. It should be as permeable own. as possible so that leaks can happen, continue to happen, and they can benefit. Chair protected. Hona chahiye. That's the top priority. Baki jo hoga hoga. Ek state ka WCD minister ke mere ghar pe mohs gaya tha. Ki aisa aisa kariye sir, thoda ye kare. Anyway, so those are those days. So political interest is which? Yeah. I mean, the thing is, if you make locally sustainable, everyone will accept. Ah, the system. problem is, I think I also agree, if it is decentralized and locally it is done, it's good. But how do you ensure the quality? Even if, you know, there, the mistake can happen not by, uh, I mean, doing it purposefully, but it may happen unknowingly because they are not technically competent. They do not have the that expertise, knowledge, and all that, you know, actually manufacturing facilities that is required for the class. So they may, ingredients they may not get you know, the right thing because you are dealing with a very small quantity, then all that economy of scale is lost. Then within the 12 rupees or 18 rupees giving that quality, it becomes a very challenging task. Yeah. But when you aggregate, do at a much le bigger level, then that 12 rupees or 18 rupees probably to great extent is addressed. But at smaller level, then you need to give a little more money. Uh, and it can be done. Yeah. So, so I should, but money. that's a better way of doing that. Uh, giving so much employment, generating local economies, even thrust. And good. actually, Locally made, even the trust is much more in what we have made, what ingredient has gone, then, then you can convince the children and all for whom you are making this food. Yeah. So that's a better in strategy. Spirit. In, in uh, Anand, uh, there is a, uh, when people say that milk turning sour, that means if you mishandle milk, it will become turn sour. So village level, the milk is collected and kept in a place. And till today, the milk getting soured has not taken place in any of the village. It has only happened in the plant. So, trusting the wisdom of the community is always there. So, what Sima Siram is mentioning that if we can perfect the decentralized model community system, there is nothing like that. Yes, absolutely. So, let's see how we can do it. Because there are infrastructures available. Hmm. You can see uh, during the millet year, there were a lot of infrastructure that were yeah. pumped into a pumped into, uh, lot of states, hmm. which are not functional right now. And many SHEs, FPOs are owning them. Hmm. And they don't know the expertise to operate it. They don't know the market linkages to uh, make it bigger. So there are uh, multiple opportunities that are available. Within the Telangana, there was a successful program called Middle Push. Hmm. Giri portion Abhyan is for the tribal welfare schools and colleges. So where the government uh, started uh, giving the millet based ready to cook meal. Mm. So in that, they are identified the SHG groups within the district and they gave the uh, processing facilities to them. Then the business directly go to them. Uh, uh, whatever that uh, monthly requirement of the district will go to the SHG. They will procure. They will process it and they will uh, send the ready to cook wala package to the school yes, 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 So college. that's how now, even the program got over, these people managed to get the external linkages where household consumption is also increasing in that area. Mm. And this is, this is like you were saying, it, it is uh, only the ownership of the SHG group. So they want to survive it after the Mm. Oh, right. Program oh, also mm. because like now uh, the government has seen the Kiriposhna might not be continued. 
So then they have to survive. Actually, I'll give you an example in, uh, in Telangana, in probably uh, how it is Anandra actually. So they have, the government, the dairy department created a lot of assets and gave it to the SHGs, that bulk milk uh, cooling facilities and all that. Several places, no? In the government building, they'll set up all the assets and they, they were actually to collect the milk and the cooperatives were collecting those days, you know, but then cooperatives got become defunct and all that. In the meantime, this uh, Tirupati, our uh, operations, NDTB started operation, which later became a producer company, mm -hmm. Mahila Milk Producer Company. So they started collecting milk from these centers and there are 54 of them. And you believe these 54 of them actually give almost 3 lakh liter milk to this uh, co I mean, this producer company. And they're all active, right? So they give them actually a 80 paisa per liter of sort of a you know, processing fee. So milk is collected by the Srija producer company's milk pulling points in the villages. And from there, milk is brought in cans to these uh, bulk milk uh, chilling facilities, right? No? And they handle all the milk there. And it's so all employed by women. Even the lifting the can and pouring it, you know, in the big A is dumped. All tanks is done by the women only. Everything. And this 80 paisa is good enough to actually employ all these women. They get some money and it's running perfectly. And it's a win-win for the Srija producer company and these uh, uh, SHG groups. Because SAG group is economically, you know, surviving on this and they get milk and they don't have to invest again. 54 bulk milk coolers, if you have to invest, it will require something like 5, 10 crore rupees unnecessarily. Why to invest all that? And no, let us, let us, so that's let, how so, uh, th th that means there are uh, no, successful I, I, I experience. Agree, I agree with you. Uh, uh, during the lockdown, I visited uh, seven plate districts in Kanyala and you don't believe uh, that the uh, no, farmer producer organizations. Even I visited to a plant which is uh, which is built uh, by an investment of 20 crore. Can you believe that farmer producing in Haryana canal district? Okay. So uh, because the government was giving subsidy to all their BOs and they have created big infrastructures in most of the districts, we find, but it is unemployed right now. It's not a 20 crore uh, infrastructure to one yes. FPO or you have communities on what is no, no, there are uh, maybe one for the people of farmers, they have uh, set up a flag processing of flag. processing, good, uh, but, uh, but, so, but who owns that the plant? That's farmers group, FPOs 20 crore funding to one FPO. Recently, I visited to Shruti, uh, Shruti project. Are you 50,000 crore ka jo government of India? No, Shruti, 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 which can be run for this, this kind of program. Because there is an exporter. Will you believe that there is an exporter? You can make pasta, you can make uh, noodles. But not acres. They do not know what to, what to do with Anyway, we are not talking about pasta and noodles no, in the supplement nutrition program. <laughs> <laughs> but but no, the idea... Can make pasta and noodles of millet. No, millet. No, no. <laughs> noodles is not bad if you can make millet. Yeah. yeah, no, no, let's be on the serious side. Uh, the one very interesting thing has co is coming out of Sri uh, Ram and Subrat's uh, experience, complemented by uh, Anil's uh, experience, is that is FPO can when it is emerging as a possible answer to this. You may uh, uh, for the uh, supplemented the case, uh, because it is a community organization and it's a business enterprise. And it's no control over the government or any vested interest do not have any control over it. They are the people are the control over it. So if proper quality control, proper production systems and processes are put in place, can they emerge as the model? Can we try it somewhere yes. in where the, the, the TSR is uh, been tried? And like in Andhra Pradesh, probably in Andhra Pradesh, this model can be tried. Because Andhra Pradesh, the ecosystem is there, good ecosystem for APOs. And good ecosystem for centralized processing or semi decentralized processing of TSR. And NIN is there. So, can something. Yeah, I think at least before. Piloting. Study, study. Yes, small team from uh, the consortium can go and study and see uh, how Telangana foods works. Uh, if, if needed, I think um, uh, Siram can go. You can join and uh, Anil will facilitate. 
and you can do a study and but come out with it. Unfortunately, last it has and then, been uh, uh, initially it is funded by I think care a long time ago, and it is built for so many years uh, earlier. But I don't know why India could not be able to replicate this kind of good model. Yeah, also. बाहर का कोई ऑर्गेनाइजेशन करता है तो रिप्लीकेशन फूड कॉर्पोरेशन क्या है आज तुम्हारे देश में हमारा देश में फूड कॉर्पोरेशन क्रिएट हुआ है फूड कॉर्पोरेशन कॉन्सेप्ट डिजाइन वाज बाय केयर बट केयर का नाम बोलना पाप है आज तो ये ये जो मॉडल के ऊपर काम करेंगे आई थिंक फ्रॉम आवर साइड मनीषा विल वर्क विथ श्री राम एंड सुब्रत सुब्रत इज ए मेम्बर सो यू मोर लेजिटिमेट टू Participate and contribute and all that. So let us think in terms of that. This can be one of our what is as an alternate model. Alternate model. What? Could, but before that, we should look at the current models. Where it falters. Understanding of the current models and, and supply chain aspect. Definitely, I am very keen to understand the Maharashtra model of WHS. I like to see that the supply chain. This Odisha, when you have this decentralized, you know, what is the cost? Have you, have, uh, is there any study of published material? In fact, in fact, if I shouldn't tell. I'm being from Odisha. I have very doubt about the efficiency of Odisha model. <laughs> they only made a hype. But anyway, I'll not. Say, I'll reserve. But few, few are running. Ah. Out of hundred, there might be three or four cases which are running. Ah, three or four cases may be running. Ninety-six cases. No, okay, but see, idea is wherever there is a success, three, four even are running. Then, if one studies carefully, we'll find you know why this is running. Ah, and ah, whereas others are failing. Really? So then we just tweak it, you know, glean all that knowledge and define as SOP. Yeah. Probably things will. My only concern was how it managing the cost. If it is managing the cost, then you have the model. If it is not. There is some subsidy or some subvention is coming from somewhere else. That is a different matter. Then there is a different matter. But otherwise, if it is working, why don't we study it and document it and let's uh, attempt at other places? Yeah. That's that's it. Yeah, everyone knows. The moment you increase the capacity, the cost will go down. Yeah, right. Unit cost will go down. No, but but yeah. but no, Odisha. That's the economy. That's the model. So, small. Small capacity. Small capacity. But if those four five are running, how they are running? रागी लड्डू इज ब्रिंगिंग ए सोल्यूशन बट लोकल फूड You cannot bring so, synthetic micronutrient and add. That's not it. Take a question. Me, hey, in the future, micronutrients you have to add, but that most of the cases is not added. It's not added. No, then we'll go against it. I'm against it. I'm all against it. Yeah, no. I know because our our uh, 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 we have already communicated it to the ministry, and minister accepted it. It is. But again, given. again, then again, the entire rice protein issue has implemented the whole country. How will oppose it? Hmm? नहीं राइस फोर्टिफिकेशन के बात नहीं कर रहे हम पीएसआर के बात राइस फोर्टिफाइड राइस है बट टीएसआर का बात कर रहे हैं हम जो आंगनवाड़ी लेवल पे दिया जाता है तो तो थिंग्स सम प्रिंसिपल्स लाइक लाइक एक्स ऑर्गेनाइजेशन विल आर यू टी एफ टू कम इन वी आर एगेंस्ट आई
Somebody will say that the, to bring energy density, we will add something. We will not do it. But there are certain ethical dimensions. And this has been already, uh, the CFNS has taken a position and has been communicated and government has acknowledged it. But if you start giving army and all, now why the nutrition is so high? Hmm. Maybe other are not, not necessary. That, that's why military is a very good uh, so add-on to the source for, uh, and there are other uh, iron providers. Even Mahuala too. Mahuala. Mahuala. Uh, so, so those uh, are the things that. Uh, untouchable foods. If you can put it in that way, you not forget an untouchable foods. Not everyone. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We are. We are. We are. Now let's yeah, let's. We will discuss it later. Uh, no, it's very important. Yeah. But these are important things. These are good. Yeah. These are very interesting knowledge is emerging out of a discussion uh, that would. Uh, even when uh, Ramboli Town spoke about the nutrient level, it's something important in the region. I heard that Purisha is going to. They announced it, but I don't know what is happening. No, Nutrigatin is a both Jagabai experiment, or as sub Jagabai, or I in fact. Nutrigatin is. In, but the Nutrigatin model that is being tried in MP. Nutrigatin model tried in MP has got a very interesting dimension that it has been adopted in under the MNRJ. And there they are making a difference. But and they, they, you have Manisha, you have gone and seen some of the Nutrigatin no? yeah. Potion bodies. And they are finding some uh, very uh, interesting uh, yes. results they are documenting. So that means it's same nutri garden concept implemented in Odisha, funded by Ajim Premji Foundation, was so bad, Ajim Premji Foundation stopped funding. And this is the, the, the truth. Ajim Premji Foundation had committed to support the NRC intervention. Yeah. They, they, uh, NRCs, countrywide. They went and made a deep stick study on the NRCs, and they're so disappointed. They said they will not invest in this. And I have access to that report. When I was approaching them, they said that look, this is the way our system works. So anyway, so what can we do for the uh, for improving the system? Hmm. That that should be the CFNS actually. actually that is that is, the, that, is our, that is our that is on our table. That is on our plate. That is on our plate. I mean, uh, less. So we have been talking this morning. So what we are supposed to do? These are the hot takes actually. So we can bring it. As, as part. Okay, so now we four o'clock. So we go to the. Are you going by the clock? <laughs> or what? Clock is the only determinant in life. Clock decides your life, my life, everybody's life, and everybody's work. Clock clocks everybody's life. That's all. Clock clocks everybody's life. So we now move to um, this. Uh, Understanding vision, mission, goal, and why a coalition model, and then uh, uh, building an institution. We are ignoring the, the session on that panel of host agency representatives, agency discussion. I think to great extent this has been talked. So we, if time permits, we'll take it up tomorrow. But uh, we'll uh, move the session five and session seven, uh, uh, session uh, uh, eight. Five and eight to be combined and start. Let's see how long. This is a very important session, and uh, uh, we, this, this whole idea is to come on the same plane as to how what is our mission, what is our vision, what is our goal, what is our objectives, and how do we how are we aligned? There is a mis misalignment. Maybe national level, uh, state level, because of the context. There may be misalignment. How do we make it aligned? That's important. So we start that. Siram will give some introductory comment and then we we'll get into the discussion. And then, of course, you'll have to come in later to conduct this session. Oh, is it? Hmm. OK. So before, actually, I mean, I don't want to give any uh, sermons. Uh, yeah, I don't believe in uh, really giving sermons, brief talking. But before we start, I have a question to all of us. Okay, so very typical of my style. So take a page out of it. I mean, your uh, this here. Yeah. Just take one uh, one page. One page. Okay. You don't have a tear. You can just write it down. Uh, I will submit it to you. 
<laughs> he is not your examiner. <laughs> will late be, then you will get it submitted, or uh, if not, then no you will you'll submit it to yourself. Okay. Basically, you know, uh, one question. First question is suppose God is pleased with you and he gives you three, you know, please, Vardhan, teen Vardhan aapko He is giving you three, three wishes. Three wishes. Okay, so you can ask anything. Agar Bhagwan ne aapko kaha ki aap ye teen Vardhan vats mango hum mujh se. Likhin ye Vardhan apne liye nahi mangna hai, CFNS ke liye mangna hai. बेचारा सुझा है तो चलो मिल गया मैं तो सोच रहा था कुछ भी नहीं मांगे खुद के लिए भाई वो भी सेम एक्सरसाइज यू कैन डू इट फॉर योरसेल्फ सो ओके सो गॉड भैया यू कैन आस्क तीन विशेष मांग दो और जो भी विश मांगोगे वो पूरा होगा ओके इच्छा इच्छा तुम्हारी इच्छा क्या है तीन इच्छाएं आपकी क्या है पहला एक क्वेश्चन है you know, wishes from the God, which will be granted, so if you want three of them, if you want to ask such a wish, if you want to ask such a wish, then what do you want to ask? If you want to ask such a wish, then what do you want to ask such a wish? Like Vasna Surya has asked that if you keep your hands on your hands, then what do you want to ask such a wish? Three of them you want to ask such a wish. So please, think for CFNS, mind you. It's not for yourself, it is for the organization. It's not for the organization, it's not for the organization, it's not for the organization. Coalition for Food and Nutrition Security, not to be confused any other CFNs <laughs> and CNFS. <laughs> okay, please. So, you are thinking about it. Then we come to the next question. Okay, let's not show it. That's why I said it, because there is a reason. What does not write? When you think about it, you are writing it, then you are together in unison, thinking and speaking. Thinking. Yes, that's why I said it. I have no limit. You have no limit. तीन पेज के मांग लो विश यार कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं लेकिन विश तीन वरदान का मतलब तीन खास वरदान होने चाहिए मेरे को वरदान दो कि भगवान बोला कि तेरे को वरदान क्या चाहिए मांग ले तो बोलता है मेरे घर हो जाए मेरा किया हो जाए मेरे गाड़ी हो जाए मेरे पैसे हो जाए मेरे हो जाए मेरी शादी हो जाए मेरा ऐसा नहीं चाहिए � तीसरा वरदान की तीन और मिल जाए ऐसा नहीं चाहिए ओके सीएफएनएस के लिए तीन विशेष क्या है तीन इच्छा आपका क्या है आप भगवान हाँ सोचो सोच के लिखा है मांगना तो है डिस्कशन स्टॉप्स थिंकिंग स्टार्ट्स राइटिंग स्टार्ट्स कुछ नहीं नो आर्डर तो कुछ जो अच्छा लगे मांग लो यार करेंट हो फ्यूचर हो जो हो गई नहीं पूरी लिस्ट कर लिस्टिंग पूरी हो गई श्रेया का भी लिस्टिंग पूरी हो गई मध्य प्रदेश स्मार्ट है, स्मार्ट कम्युनिटी, डिस्टर्ब मत कर, अपना ही हो सोच, डिस्कस नहीं, डिस्टर्ब मत कर, डिस्टर्ब मत कर, हो गया? रो, पीपल आर राइटिंग, टेक योर टाइम, आराम से
नहीं रखिए अपने पास अपने हाँ याद रहेगा आपको ट्राई टू वेरी ट्रांसपेरेंट आपने हो गए आप यू आर नॉट इन्फ्लुस बाई अदर आइडिया अब ये इस पन्ने को जरा पलट दीजिए मतलब सेकंड पेज पर लिखना आपको दूसरे देखना नहीं अपना okay. अपना नोट को अपना देखना नहीं नहीं देखना उन देख सकते कोई ऐसा नहीं है बट उसी पेज पे चाहिए हमें दूसरी साइड है अब क्या है पहला सवाल था कि आप सीएफएनएस के लिए भगवान से क्या वरदान मांग रहे हो तो आपने मांग लिया वरदान अब जो है भगवान और खुश हो गए और उन्होंने कहा कि तो बच्चे बड़े अच्छे हो बच्चे संस्था के लिए मांग रहे हो अब मैं तुमको दो चीज और देना चाहता हूँ ये वरदान तीन नहीं है दो ही है वो खुद के लिए लेकिन क्या है उसमें एक कैच है कैच क्या है भगवान बोलते हैं तुमको कुछ ऐसी शक्ति चाहिए दो ऐसी शक्तियां मांग लो ताकि ये सीएफएनएस के तीन चीजें पूरी हो जाए तो तुमको क्या चाहिए वो दो शक्तियां तुम्हें क्या चाहिए समझ में आने बात वॉट आर द टू स्ट्रेंथ दैट यू नीड इन योर सेल्फ टू एम टू गेट दो वरदान योर सेल्फ 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 मुझ में ये भगवान ये दो शक्तियां देना चाहते हैं है ना तो मुझे क्या दो शक्तियां चाहिए so that... ये तीन चीज जो वरदान मांगी है वो पूरा होने में आसान हो जाए भगवान का वरदान सिद्ध हो जाए सेफनेस का क्वालिफिकेशन नहीं 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 अब जो सोच वो तो हो गया ना अब ये सोचो कि हमें क्या चाहिए हो सकता है कि तीनों ने यार कुछ तो करना नहीं चाहिए शक्ति चाहिए जिसके वजह से सीएफएनएस के जो तीन विश मांगे हैं वो हो सकता है फुलफिल हो सकता है कर पाओगे उसे तीनों जो विश है आपका वो आप फुलफिल कर पाओगे क्या शक्ति होना चाहिए दो शक्ति ऐसे चाहिए दो मेरे को बोलेगा मैं मेरे, मेरे रोज नॉनवेज में रुक खेला अनिल के साथ ओके okay. हो गया ग्रेट और अनिल का भी हो गया वेरी गुड और इसको जरा कैप्चर करें सुब्रत हो गया हाँ ये देखिए ये तो फर्स्ट वन टू डू सी 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 में है ना मेरा जो इसका काफी एसोसिएटेड रहे हाँ शुरू से बनाने का टाइम से ओके यू कैन क्लीन दिस अप एंड यूज इट ब्लैक वाला चलता है और रेड वाला चलता है ब्लैक वाला अच्छा चलता है कला मेरे पास है सॉरी सो ये था सीएफएनएस के वरदान से और ये थे आपके राइट ना सो बेसिकली आई वांट टू कैप्चर सो कहा यहाँ शुरू करें लेकिन राज थ्री और थ्री और अच्छा यहाँ चले यहाँ सुन आज प्रोग्राम मैनेजर को सीएफएनएस के लिए मेरी तीन विषय है एक इज फ्रॉम कॉलेशन अच्छा ऐसा वरदान मांगना चाहिए भगवान से कि भगवान को समझ में आया मांगना क्या चाहता है <laughs> अगर भगवान को क्लियरिटी नहीं आएगी तो ऐसा मांगो कि जो स्पष्ट लगे भैया ये चीज मांग रहा है हमें ही समझ में आ जाए तो भगवान को समझ में आएगा ना यार तो स्ट्रॉन्ग क्वालिशन मतलब ये तो चलो लिख लेता हूँ मैं पर समझ में नहीं आया क्या करना क्या चाहते हो यार आप सीखते थे मैं बताऊंगा
ये वरदान में वरदान मांग रहा है मेंबरशिप इंक्रीज और क्या मांगना क्या चाहते हो वरदान में यार सी एफ एन नॉलेज इंस्टीट्यूशन बन जाए तो मुझे समझ में नहीं आया ना कहना क्या चाहते हो समझ में आ रहा है आप मैं भी भगवान के लिए प्रार्थना करूंगा यार तुम्हारी तरफ से बताओ समझ में आना चाहिए अभी मतलब हमारे पास प्रोडक्ट्स निकलते हैं बट मैं ये चाहता हूँ सी एफ एन एस इतने ऊपर जाए कि वो खुद एक नॉलेज इंस्टीट्यूशन की तरह पहचाना जाना चाहिए जैसे कोई यूनिवर्सिटी तो नहीं क्या कॉलेज या यूनिवर्सिटी बन जाए क्या मतलब भगवान नहीं दे पाएंगे ना यार भगवान दे नहीं पाएंगे क्या ओके एक बार ये क्रेडिबिलिटी बढ़े मैंने दो क्रेडिबिलिटी लाइक चलो फाइनेंशियल सस्टेनेबल हो जाए ये तीन आपने मांग लिए भगवान फर्स्ट क्लास ये समझ में आ गया भगवान तुरंत अब बताओ सेल्फ क्या मांगे क्या मांगा क्या था कंफ्यूज मुझे इस तरह का कंफ्यूज मुझे इन तीनों को कंप्लीट करने की पोटेंशियल डोनर्स चाहिए तुम्हारे अंदर शक्ति मांगा था ना भगवान ने तो और डोनर कैंसर और और कोसने नहीं लाइजनिंग विद स्ट्रांग नेटवर्क ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन तुम्हारे अंदर शक्ति क्या चाहिए लाइजनिंग लाइजनिंग स्ट्रांग लाइजनिंग पावर लाइजनिंग स्किल चाहिए मतलब मुझे ऐसा बना दो कि मैं लाइज इन एक बार आपसे बात करूंगा मान जाऊ मान जाए यही बोलना चाहिए था ना मुझे ऐसी शक्ति को कन्विंसिंग पावर दो भगवान की मैं किसी बन तो तुम्हारा क्लैरिटी लाओ सोच में चलो ठीक है मेरे को क्लैरिटी दो कंफ्यूज हो गए चलो अल्लेस गो दिस में मेरा थोड़ा अजीब अजीब है अजीब है अजीब है अजीबो गरीब है ठीक है बताओ पहला कि मुझे इतना फंड मिल जाए कि सारे स्टेट तुझे मिल जाए फंड अरे सीएफएनएस की बात हो रही है तो ये कहना चाहते हो कि सी एफ एस को इतना पैसा मिल जाए कि पूरे और हम इंटरनेशनल 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 लेवल के पोलिशन हो जाए तो बाहर भी जाकर पोलिशन करो बिल्कुल सर एशिया एशिया के बाद आलो विश्वान मांगने में क्या जाता है ये बताओ इंटरनेशनल लेवल के पोलिशन बन जाओ उसका मतलब क्या हुआ समझना चाहिए ना इसका मतलब क्या हुआ नेशनल लेवल कौन सी कॉलिशन है तुम्हारा जी आई जेड बहुत सारे इंटरनेशनल तुम्हारे कॉलिशन पार्टनर हुए तो इंटरनेशनल कॉलिशन का मतलब क्या हुआ हाउ जी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम वॉट इट इज टूडे आज के दिन जो है एसीएफएनएस और तुम जो कहे उसमें अंतर क्या है भगवान क्या करें उसमें कि वो क्या अंतर देखना चाहते हो ओवरऑल हर देश से हर सॉरी हर देश से हमारे सारे मेंबर हो जाएं और हम ओवरऑल जैसे इंडिया लेवल के मतलब हम दूसरे देशों में भी काम करें ऐसा सो कोलिशन टू वर्क आउटसाइड इंडिया और और मतलब ह्यूमैनिटी के लिए काम करो और 
चलो ठीक है ओके समझ में आया मतलब कहना चाहते हो कि हम केवल यही काम नहीं कर रहे हैं छह राज्यों की बात नहीं कर रहे हैं हम तो पूरे महादेश की बात कर रहे हैं और सातों महादेश में काम कर रहे हैं छह राज्य नहीं सात महादेश चाहिए ओके दूसरा तीसरा हो गया तीनों हो गया तुम्हारा सेल्फ के सेल्फ क्या चाहिए हाँ बताओ बड़े कितने बड़े ग्लोबल फंड का चीफ हो जाओ अच्छा ओके जस्ट जो थिंक जो ये मांग रहा है वो मिल पाएगा क्यों नहीं मिल पाएगा क्योंकि इस भगवान ने कहा कुछ और मांगा इसमें कुछ उन्होंने भगवान ने क्या मांगा तुम्हें अच्छा शक्ति चाहिए तो इसने क्या मांग लिया पद मांग लिया नहीं 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 फंड बन जाएगा तो पैसा दे देगा ना स्किल थोड़ी है वो वो थोड़ी मिल पाएगा उसका भी तुम्हें भगवान ने क्या तुम्हें ऐसी कौन शक्ति चाहिए शक्ति नहीं है नहीं यार ये पद शक्ति तो नहीं है दूसरा बताओ अनलिमिटेड नॉलेज देखो तुमको नॉलेज चाहिए था मैटरनल हेल्थ एंड न्यूट्रिशन में तब पद चाहिए ग्लोबल भगवान भी बोले भैया ये ओके चलो एक तुम्हारा मान लिया बर्दाश्त अब वही दो ही था नहीं है नहीं दो ही था तुम सवाल नहीं सुनते हो ठीक से भैया देखो मिला लेते ओके निशा जो मेंबर है परमानेंट रहे आगे बढ़े बेसिकली रेफरिंग टू दैट ओनली ना व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द सस्टेनेबिलिटी का मतलब क्या होना चाहते हैं क्योंकि पैकेज हमारे मेंबर्स स्पेसिफिक जैसे मैंने पहले देखा था मेंबरशिप इसमें तो वो स्ट्रांग लोग ही थे उनको चाहिए मतलब आयर हम गया आयर टाइप का है हां सो जो हमारे मेंबर बने एक बार जो बन जाए वो बच्ची का रहा है मेंबर सस्टेनेबिलिटी ओके सो मेंबर्स केवल 500 नहीं जा रहा बट ही मेंबर्स के हमारे सस्टेनेबल हां ओके मेंबर्स भी हमारे साथ सस्टेन करे साथ रहे नहीं कि आए जाए नहीं हो तो नंबर तो नहीं होगा बट नंबर बिकम्स अ परमानेंट नंबर ओके आई गेट इट ओके व्हाट एल्स या या सो द रिसोर्सेस गेट स्ट्रेंथन फाइनेंशियल एज वेल एज इन टर्म्स ऑफ मॉडल रिसोर्स शेयर एंड टॉकिंग अबाउट जनरल फंड गोइंग इन लाइक सेकंड वी सी इज फाइनेंशियल सस्टेनेबिलिटी मॉडल सस्टेनेबिलिटी उंड 
then the partnership with GIZ that is the core task. So I mean to say that uh, you know, uh, in one way or the other, we are contributing to the knowledge base of food and nutrition security. So what you are saying is that we are constantly engaged in building knowledge, is it? You are right. In a way, it is the is relatable to this or self Ah, uh, we are right. <laughs> okay, now come to the self. So this is similar to the point that what Satin has made is uh, networking that results in fruitful collaboration. So a strong listening skill, or what is that you want in yourself? Um, so this was the second one. The first issue was that I want some decision making power. So decision making power is again uh, what you are talking in terms of a skill or in terms of a order, in terms of position. Uh, Position. position, then he is not granting that. So, <laughs> the, the skill he only can give you. So, uh, skill. Decision making power. Power is uh, coming out of knowledge, then probably it is. If it is coming out of the position, then it is not. So, what is that? It's you not, mean? Like, management, but on some uh, components, way, on the authority level. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Actually, very specific. Huh? I'll come to you know at the end why I have asked this. I mean, it's, it's, it's a very in depth way of you know these questions and all gives a lot of meaning. Uh, why actually it is right? No, so, 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 Okay, so we become a, what do you say? Influencer. Okay. government That is that is that is you want. So we become uh, acceptable to government in whatever advice that we give. So uske liye koi coin kya sa word kya sakta hai? Influencer, हम जो लिखा है हमारा चुट में that we share with us is influencer. So you're saying top, top influencer with the government. But the Hamari Bako Kate will cut it. If that happens, our other problem solved. Yeah. So, yeah. So, uh, yeah. 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 Yes, sir, advocacy. Yes. Lazening with logic. Mm -hmm. and... Advocacy, lazening also. Yeah, yeah. You advocate by you advocate. Yeah. Yes. Yes. There is a shade. There are two different shades. And the second one is technical ability. Ah. So, yeah, what is the technical ability? Technical ability is like I have the power to write better proposals for <coughs> So, you are saying, I have a lot of writing skills. Proposal writing skills. Proposal writing skills. Is it proposal writing skill or just writing skill? So what proposal writing? Proposal development. Sir, if I have technical ability, I can write a proposal. Proposal writing skill. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was saying. So it is writing skill, not proposal, because proposal is a subset of that. Writing skill is like both. Report and enforcement. Writing skill. So writing skill includes everything. Very good. Very good. Very good. Proposal writing skill. If you write proposal, then probably writing a letter is not the skill. So she is saying that uh, give me a good writing, so I can write proposal, I can do analysis, I can do anything that I write. Okay, okay. I think it makes sense. Yeah. Why to narrow it? Why to limit it? She is only focusing to the proposal that I don't think she made it very clear. Reason being, she wanted to have more points. That is what she made. That's why. First one is financial self. Sir, I think less clear here. Yeah. All that is here. Yeah. 
ओके मैम विथ योर लॉर्ड एक्सपीरियंस प्लीज सो सी एफ एन एस को क्या चाहिए हालांकि आप आप सब सबसे कम दिनों से जुड़ी हुई है सी एफ एन एस से बट यू आर अच्छा पहले वरदान नहीं मांगा क्वेश्चन ही पूछेंगे कहाँ मांगा अभी बोला नहीं आपने अच्छा ओके भगवान देने के लिए हाँ देने के लिए राजी है ना आज तो आ, आज तो ऐसा दिन है आज तो महा जो मांगे वो मिलेगा आज सो प्लीज गो है लेकिन मैं सी एफ एन एस से भगवान से ये वरदान मांगना चाहूंगी कि सी एफ एन एस जो नहीं कर रहा है वो करे मतलब तो बहुत कुछ नहीं कर रहा है तो फाइनेंशियल सस्टेनेबल ये तो है मेरे लिए लेकिन मैं इस पॉइंट को भी इसमें ऐड नहीं करूंगी मेरा कुछ ये था कि जो सी एफ एन एस जो पार्टनर्स जो ले रहा है मतलब कोलेबरेट कर रहे हैं उसमें हो सकता है एनजीओ नहीं है सब है लेकिन सबसे ज्यादा अगर हो सके तो गवर्नमेंट पार्टनर्स जो है गवर्नमेंट के जो हम जो हमारा काम है पूरा न्यूट्रिशन से काम है रिलेटेड काम है अगर हम वो गवर्नमेंट से ही मर्ज हो मतलब गवर्नमेंट के साथ हमारा काम हो तो वो हमको और आगे तक लेके जाए तो चाहिए क्या वरदान क्या हुआ वरदान ये है कि गवर्नमेंट पार्टनर्स हमें जितनी ज्यादा हो सके हम उसको गवर्नमेंट हमारे कॉलेज मेंबर है हो ही नहीं सकते ना गवर्नमेंट वाले नहीं डिपार्टमेंट था मैंने देर इज नो बोर्ड बोर्ड एंड That is not a membership. Yeah, that is because government has to have a say in CFNS. You also need, you know, certain credibility. Yeah, if there are four people sitting from the government, then it is seen to be a government uh, supported. Yeah, supported organization. So, मतलब ही अलग है ना. But member, government will not become a member. Yeah, because government becomes a member, they become subservient to CFNS, which is not possible. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. So let's understand now what is the concern. तो आप वरदान क्या चाहती है कि हम काम करें गवर्नमेंट के साथ या तो मतलब ये जो इम्प्लीमेंटेशन रोल भी हमारे साथ केवल हम एडवोकेसी और उसमें ना लगे खाली बात ही नहीं करें काम भी करके दिखाए तो हम आउटपुट से दिखाए कि हाँ ये हमारा काम है हालांकि ये पॉसिबिलिटी है आज के दिन में भी एज ए मॉडल एंड ऑल ओके चलिए ठीक है स्किल्स स्किल्स इसी के रिलेटेड ही मेरा स्किल्स है फुल सपोर्ट सीएफएलएस से फुल सपोर्ट फुल सपोर्ट फ्रॉम सपोर्ट फ्रॉम सीएफएलएस टू टू मी एंड दैट्स द स्किल तो इसमें फिर इसकी स्किल होगी मेरे मेरे को चाहिए ना अगर सीएफएलएस मेरे साथ जुड़ेगा अगर मेरे को पूरा सपोर्ट देगा आप किसके बात करें क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 या क्वेश्चन 2 क्वेश्चन 2 है क्वेश्चन 2 के साथ मेरा रिलेटेड हां तो क्वेश्चन 2 में आपको स्किल चाहिए भगवान ने कहा दो ऐसी क्षमताएं मांग लो तो पहली क्षमता क्या है बोर्ड में रहना चाहिए 
very very powerful is line with the comprehensive thinking of the top of all the organization right मतलब आप चाहती हैं कि कोशिश आपका दिमाग आपके अंदर चला जाए ऐसा ठीक है ठीक है बट ऐसे स्किल आई एग्री बिकॉज यू वॉन्ट की उनकी जो सोच है उस समय अलाइन हो जाए ब्यूटिफुल वेरी पावरफुल पॉइंट या सेकेंड एक ऐसा अरे आप यहाँ मांग लेते हैं ना की हर एक स्टॉप में दो दो आदमी दिलवा दो आपने घर जगह मांगा आपने सोचा नहीं कहा मांगना था आप सी सी साइकोलॉजिकल इंटरप्रिटेशन ऑफ दिस अगर आप सोचते बड़े लेवल में यार मुझे जो प्रॉब्लम हो रही है वो सबको हो रही होगी तो यहाँ मांगते हैं ना लेकिन आपने क्या सोचा मेरे अंदर दो आदमी चाहिए सी इट्स अ वेरी वेरी नैरो वे ऑफ थिंकिंग सो दैट्स आई एम नॉट इंक्लूडिंग इन दरूरी होगा हम कहा कर रहे हैं जो जो सारी जगह इंक्लूड नहीं किया अभी अभी बहुत मुश्किल भगवान ने कहा ना कैच दिया वरदान यहाँ मांगनी थी वहाँ स्किल मांगना था लेकिन हम क्या देखो हर समय ऐसे ही होता है जनरली हम जब जाते हैं भगवान के पास तो क्या चलो अभी नहीं करेंगे चर्चा नहीं करेंगे बाद ओके हाँ जी नेक्स्ट मेरा पहला क्वेश्चन जो है वो है है वो आदत है कैसे फोरम में क्वेश्चन ही पूछा जाता है मतलब जो भी गोल डिसाइड किया जाए सीएफ एन एस का वो कम्प्लीट हो जाए भगवान मांगो थोड़ा और थोड़ा मांग ले यार तो एक तो है कि भगवान हमारे जितने भी हमने गोल सेट किए हैं वो समय पर तय हो जाए हो जाए प्राप्त हो जाए बट गोल सेट ही नहीं करे तो चलो ठीक है वो केयर के पी आई को लेकर परेशान हो जा रहा है दूसरा दो गोल क्या है बताओ जरा सी एफ एन एस के दो गोल एक तो हमारा जो है सो हंगरनेस जो है हमारा वो कोई भी हंगरनेस जो है वो नहीं होना चाहिए ये आपका गोल है और और गोल और दूसरा गोल तो समझ रहे हो ना ये गोल गोल है पूरा ये इसीलिए कह रहा था इट्स नॉट दैट सिंपल टू आस्क भगवान से वरदान में इतना आसान नहीं है वरदान मिलता भी क्यों नहीं है क्यों हम खुद ही नहीं सोचते हैं भगवान कुछ भी मांग लो जिस दिन मन से मांगोगे पक्का मिलेगा इसलिए मैंने कहा था सोचो सोच के चलो दूसरा बताओ दूसरा है कि हमारे सीएफएनएस के जितने भी टीम है उसमें लेस कम्युनिकेशन हो कम्युनिकेशन गैप ना लेस कम्युनिकेशन इज मोर कम्युनिकेशन कम्युनिकेशन गैप नहीं ओके सो ये सबसे बड़ा कम्युनिकेशन लेस ना हो सीएफएनएस टीम ये ये सबसे बड़ा प्रॉब्लम है टू लेस कम्युनिकेशन ये नहीं आता वर्क एज दिस कम्युनिकेशन लेस ना हो ये भी लेस लगा आगे आगे लेस ओके okay, कहना ये चाहते हो कि जो हमारी सी एफ एस टीम है टीम के रूप में कोहेसिवली काम करे एक होकर एक स्वर में काम करे ओके okay, यूनिशन में काम करे चलो वेरी गुड तीसरा जो तीसरा हमारा जो है वो हमारा सी एफ एन एस का जो फिजिबिलिटी है वो डिस्ट्रिक्ट लेवल मतलब ब्रॉड लेवल से इंटरनेशनल लेवल पर अच्छी तरह से फिजिबिलिटी सो सेफनेस की विजिबिलिटी इंटरनेशनल हो जाए लोकल लोकल हो सकता है मैं आप देख रहा हूँ कोई लोकल टू ग्लोबल विजिबिलिटी मतलब हर स्तर पर हमारी विजिबिलिटी हो नॉट ओनली लोकल बट आल्सो इंटरनेशनल चलिए और 
नहीं नहीं आगे स्किल 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 एक स्किल है कि ऑनरशिप जो होता है वर्क करने का जो ऑनरशिप होता है वो स्किल हमने आया समझाए मैं भी नहीं समझ रहा जो भी कोई काम हमें या हमने जो इंसान में एक ऐसा चीज होता है वो तो कोई भी काम कोई ऑनरशिप लेके नहीं काम होता तो मेरे अंदर जो होना चाहिए जो डीलिंग विथ फीलिंग का जो काम होता है वो ऑनरशिप लेके हम काम करें ये स्किल हम देते हैं स्किल है किसी ने बोल दिया है हमको बनाने के लिए बल्कि इसलिए बनाऊ क्योंकि मेरे इम्पोर्टेंट है मैं इसका मैं इसमें इन्वॉल्व हो जाऊँ ये कहना चाहते हो ना सो बेसिकली वो राशि की जो भी काम करते हो उसमें आप आपकी जो ओनरशिप चलिए ठीक और और मेरा दूसरा जो है सो एज ए गुड कम्युनिकेटर या स्पोक पर्सन की लगे गुड कम्युनिकेशन कहीं पर नहीं आया गुड कम्युनिकेशन स्किल नहीं है एक्सलेंट कम्युनिकेशन गुड़ी क्या जैस जो मांगे ना तो ऐसा मांगो यार एक्सलेंट कम्युनिकेशन इसमें वेरी गुड चलिए नेक्स्ट अनिल ही वाज द वन हु कंप्लीटेड फर्स्ट मैं तो इसको हटा सकते हैं हाँ इसको ऊपर कर सकते हैं जरूरत नहीं है यार बाद में जरूरत पड़ेगा लोगों को चलिए कोई बात नहीं हाँ जी तो सी एफ एन एस बिकम्स ए पी एम यू फॉर द गवर्नमेंट बार बार थोड़ी अब अगले साल अलग अलग प्रोजेक्ट स्टेट स्पेसिफिक प्रोजेक्ट भी इधर आ जाएगा मैं मुझे नहीं चाहिए केवल एक सेंट्रल प्रोजेक्ट की वो नहीं कर रहा है स्टेट स्पेसिफिक प्रोजेक्ट भी मिले वो भी बनाइए प्रोजेक्ट ओके वेरी गुड हो गया आपका तीन हो गया तो आपको पूरा नॉलेज एंड स्किल चाहिए अंडरलाइन फूड एंड न्यूट्रिशन ओके नेक्स्ट कैपेसिटी टू नेगोशिएट विद द एंड एरिया कैपेसिटी टू नेगोशिएट नेगोशिएटिंग अप तो अबड़ो के साइड ओके लाइजनिंग एवरीथिंग कम टू नेगोशिएटिंग स्किल हां नेगोशिएटिंग स्किल नेगोशिएशन परसुएट करेगा एकदम समझाएगा एक्सेलेंट नेगोशिएशन स्किल वेरी गुड हाँ जी संजीव जी सर मेरा तीन मूवी जो है सी एफ एन एस के लिए पहला है स्ट्रॉगेस्ट वर्ल्ड एसम जो ऑलरेडी रखा गया है हाँ जी चलिए ठीक है दूसरा है सी एस आर फंड अक्रोस द स्टेट आई मीन अक्रोस इंडिया फाइनेंशियल 
मेबी आई एम कैचरिंग यू फॉर टेलिंग दैट सीएसआर भी एक ब्रैकेट में डाल दिया मैंने ओके हां जी हां सीएसएलएस में फूड एंड न्यूट्रिशन एक्सपर्टाइज होना चाहिए पर्सनल ओके फूड एंड मेटर नॉलेज ओके सो फूड थीमेटिक एक्सपर्टाइज एंड न्यूट्रिशन फूड एक्सपर्ट न्यूट्रिशन एक्सपर्टाइज भगवान मुझे कमिटी ऑफ डेडिकेटेड बना दो और चाहिए भाई नहीं नहीं है नहीं है क्या है क्या है हाँ हमारे सुब्रत जी बताइए so you play the field i mean role in terms of knowledge imparting or actually no, not, you are talking about really able to demonstrate and do things yes okay not, take not the knowledge as such i'm talking about uh, critical voice into the important essential voice so voice that that voice. becomes actually an influencer the government no, which is there jaise sunita narayan jo bolegi the government top influencer the government so yeah that is all as of now what is happening because there are even Take an example. Me also, I worked without in my role implementing the program, developing the policies. Many people know that government will make a policy because then without safe and also agree. Now I see there is an emerging opportunities. Uh, there is a need also in the whole country because the uh, entire political structure is getting changed, reformed, new system is coming, political system is being set up. In those space, everyone is feeling there is a need because for long the old deficit system is going on. Chori or the hoyi raha hai because nobody is talking about that. So what I mean to say that we should play a critical role, not as an individual organization taking every actually. Uh, yeah. So what partners I'm... that our voice is heard by the government, our voice is heard by the UNICEF and everyone. Top See, influence of the government. Yes. Right. Sir. Next. These are three pieces. हो गया कंपोनेंट एरियाज माय ओके सेल स्किल सेट में कुछ है पता नहीं गेट मोर एक्सपर्ट्स रिसोर्सेज टू एनलिस्ट ऑल द विशेस नो ठीक है तो आप आपके अपने लिए क्या मांगा मैं वही मांग रहा हूं हां अगर मेरे पास और एक्सपर्ट होगा एक्सपर्ट होगा इसके लिए आदमी होगा नो नहीं नहीं आई एम नॉट आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट एक्सपर्टाइज 
चलो ठीक है और ओके okay. दूसरा कुछ है भगवान मुझे ऐसी क्षमता दो कि पांच रिसोर्स मेरे साथ काम करने लगे मेरे पास और तो हो गया ना राय आज के मुझे पांच आदमी दे दो डिफरेंस बिटवीन यू नो व्हाट स्किल यू वांट एंड व्हाट सी आई एम स्टैंडिंग हियर भगवान मेरे को पांच आदमी मेरे साथ पीछे लग जाए काम करते रहे ये शायद मिलन नहीं मिलेगा भगवान मेरे ऐसी क्षमता दे दो पांच को कन्विंस कर दूंगा जो मैं कहूँ करे I think same thing I'm asking, but, but then it is I'm driving myself. In the other one, I'm driving God to do such work for me. There's a huge difference between the two. So actually, be the initiative taker. You open up, right? No, he said, "Kahan hai? Pani responsibility, ownership lo." You, who are going to ask for it, also he has put it on God. You are not taking it on yourself. So, my dear, I think this is what we need to bring about a change in the way CFNS thinks and works. Actually, complete. Out, so, your. Yeah, or like. We could be able to establish some state offices also to certain operational support. Okay, but these things you have not asked me. This is my personal issue. Okay, but you skill skill not asked. You have said that God has said that it is okay. Then we will think about it. Now, ignore it. Come on, come on. Line, last. Sir, my issue is that first, there is a JPNS. Sir, no. What are you asking? You are asking about something else. Let's talk about it. जैसे पुष्टि सर बोर्ड मेंबर भी पूरा परफेक्ट एक्टिव होके काम करे ऐसे में भगवान को मांग रहे कि विशेष मांग रहे कि सारे जितना सीवनेस का बोर्ड वो तो डेंजर हो जाएगा डेंजर हो जाएगा आती आती हो जाएंगे तो सोचें हम लोग का मोर फंड आ आ जाएगा डेंजर हो जाएगा मोर इंटरफेरेंस आई एम इंटरफेरिंग एक्चुअली व्हाट आई एम डूइंग टुडे इज नॉट द रोल ऑफ � ओके, सो दिस इज़ इट, दिस इज़ विशेष, हाँ, सेल्फ का अपना बताओ, सेल्फ मांगो, सेल्फ, आज तो कम्युनिकेशन स्किल लगता है यार, मेरा कम्युनिकेशन स्किल एंड मेरे को ऐसे पावर दे दीजिए मैं बोर्ड मेंबर हूँ कर दे करके, जो जो बाइल आपको रिव्यू करके मैं ये इंप्लीमेंटेशन पार्ट जो पार्ट ये कर सकते हो निगोसिएशन है कमिटेड है लेकिन आपकी कहीं नहीं नीचे कमिटेड है एकदम लास्ट में ये कमिटेड एंड डेडिकेटेड है उसका पॉइंट है ऊपर 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 से स्ट्रॉंग लाइसेंसिंग है नॉलेज है एंड वो कैसी राइटिंग स्किल है अलाइनमेंट विथ कॉम्प्रेंसिव थिंकिंग और पील इंडिया ऑनरशिप एक्सेलेंट इंवॉल्वमेंट ओके ठीक है कम्युनिकेशन कम्युनिकेशन कैसे हो सकता है वर्षा पंडित बुआ बैठे हैं कि अब मिस कर गई अपना स्किल सेट मांगना हाँ जी गुड सो कम्युनिकेशन आगे दो आपको नहीं नहीं दोनों मांग लिया है उसको ज़्यादा दिल मांग जाते हो क्या ओके ग्रेट आई थिंक वी हैव ऑलमोस्ट सेट द कैनवास फॉर सीएस दिस इज़ व्हाट � समझ रहा हमें अपने आप में जहां जितने लोग बैठे हैं उसमें ये चीजें चाहिए और हमें करना क्या है वो चीजें दिस इज द विजन दिस इज द मीन्स एंड वी हैव टू वर्क ऑन इट राइट क्या चाहते हो भैया देख लो सी हाउ ब्यूटिफुली अ ग्रुप ऑफ अस हैज डिस्क्राइब यू नो व्हाट एक्चुअली वी वॉन्ट सी एफ टू डू इससे इससे अच्छा डेफिनेशन कोई नहीं दे सकता था एंड दिस इज़ अ कलेक्टिव वी हैव डिफाइन्ड दिस इज़ एक्जेक्टली व्हाट वी वांट सीएफएनएस टू हमारे ड्रीम क्या है व्हाट इज़ यू नो हमारे अपेक्षा है क्या है हमारा सपना क्या है सीएफएनएस से तो हम क्या चाहते हैं वी वांट सीएफएनएस टू बिकम मेंबर जो हमारे 
बड़े हैं लेकिन क्वालिटी के मेंबर फिर बोलना चाहते हो कि हमारी क्रेडिबिलिटी जो है नॉलेज में फूड न्यूट्रिशन में टॉप लेवल की हो परफेक्ट फूड न्यूट्रिशन में हमारे पास एक्सपर्ट्स होने चाहिए जो आज नहीं है तो होने चाहिए राइट देन यू आर सेइंग स्टाफ फाइनेंशियल सस्टेनेबिलिटी हमारी जो बहुत लोगों ने कहा हमारे लगभग पांच साल मतलब मोर देन सिक्सटी परसेंट की फाइनेंशियली सस्टेनेबिलिटी आनी चाहिए राइट ना देन आपने कहा कि स्टेट स्पेसिफिक प्रोजेक्ट भी होने चाहिए इंटरनेशनल लेवल पॉलिसी के लिए भी काम करना चाहिए कि हम बाहर भी हम अपनी क्षमता के अनुसार काम कर सकते हैं कॉन्स्टेंटली इंगेज विद बिल्डिंग नॉलेज जो हमारे नॉलेज है कॉन्स्टेंटली हम ऐसा काम करें बिल्ड होता रहे हम स्टैगनेट ना हो उस पर हम रुके नहीं हमारे आई एम कमिंग टू द गुड लीडर तो ठीक है दैट विल कम लेटर टॉप इन्फ्लुएंसर विद द गवर्नमेंट सी एफ एन एस के ऐसे पेडिशनल पर होना चाहिए कि गवर्नमेंट को अगर कहा जाए तो गवर्नमेंट उसको ना ना कर सके ये हमारी जो है होनी चाहिए सपोज टूडे वी हैड मिस्टर स्वामी डॉक्टर स्वामीनाथन and maybe such two three persons in the board do think whatever it says will be ignored by the government it cannot be no so something that type of a stature government our organization should have that stature can come how you have to think of can you demonstrate something kya isne do cheeze ki aur karke dikha diya paanch cheeze ki karke dikha diya so nobody will ignore you so i think something that is required so this is a very very important point then comes a cfns to become a PMU to the central government means basically उसी से related है top influencer की बात हो रही है strong and good support government support to the uh, to CFNS मिले भगवान ऐसा करो कोई तो तभी होगा जब ये तीनों aligned है basically एक ही चीज को हम अलग अलग कर रहे हैं all board members to become activists हमारे जो board members हैं आज के दिन में हम तभी मिलते हैं जब हमारी board meeting होती है या तो ऐसा ना हो थोड़ा active हो सोचे इसके लिए तभी ये संस्था इस तरह top level की संस्था बनेगी what is exactly expected the board member बोर्ड की तो अपनी कोई रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी है रोल है आर वी रियली प्लेइंग द रोल दैट बोर्ड एक्चुअली शुड बी प्लेइंग इफ नॉट देन एक्चुअली भगवान ऐसा करो कि इनको रोल प्ले करें इट्स अ वेरी गुड विश एक्चुअली बिंद्राज अदास फॉर एंड आई थिंक वी कैन स्पेंड अ फुल डे विद आवर बोर्ड मेंबर्स है राइट एंड कट सी बिंद्राज ओके देन इंप्लीमेंटेशन रोल बी पार्ट ऑफ द सीएस सी एफ एन एस शुड नॉट ओनली बिकम अ कागजी घोड़ा you should not only talk, uh, talk about theories and all that you know picking from here and there but actually should become a, a, an organization which can talk by evidences has done it demonstrated it shown it and hence is talking that that stench is come should back us that agar aapko aapne kuch kiya hua hai to apne bhi itni shakti aa jati hai ki jo aap bolte ho wo jo hai na wo keval shabd nahi rehte balki wo mantra ban jate hai samajh raha to wo jo cfns jo baat kare wo mantra ki tarah ki baat kare तो तभी संभव है जब हमारे लोगों में वन ऑफ़ हैज एक्चुअली डन समथिंग इन द फील्ड एंड 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 ही टॉकिंग फ्रॉम दैट एक्सपीरियंस नॉट जस्ट फ्रॉम व्हाट हैज बीन रेड हेयर एंड देयर और ग्लीम फ्रॉम हेयर एंड तो दैट इज द डिफरेंस वेरी गुड पॉइंट एंड देन कम्स इंप्लीमेंट हो गया अकाउंट जो भी हम लक्ष्य तय करते हैं वो समय से पूरा होना चाहिए ये नहीं कह दिया कुछ कभी हो रहा है नहीं हो रहा है समय बीतता जा रहा है अभी पहला क्वार्टर दूसरा क्वार्टर तीसरा क्वार्टर एंड एफ क्वार्टर दिखना अंडरस्टैंड्स वेल सो ओके तो वो नहीं होना चाहिए सीएफएनएस टीम टू वर्क एज अ कोहेसिव टीम इन यूनिशन मतलब सीएफएनएस की टीम जो है ऐसा लगे कि एक 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 ऐसी टीम है जो एक साथ जुड़ी हुई है सब साथ मिलकर चलते चलो यार उसको तो उसको कर रहेगा अपना काम भगवान के वरदान पर ध्यान दो <laughs> तो वो आपने मांगा विच वॉज अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग राइट और अंतिम में आपने कहा इंटरनेशनल विजिबिलिटी लोकल टू ग्लोबल मतलब केवल हमारी विजिबिलिटी लोकल लेवल में ना हो बल्कि नेशनल इंटरनेशनल लेवल तक हो इस लेवल के अंदर इमेजिन वॉट इज दैट यू वॉन्ट अगर ये संस्था हो जाए तो इससे कोई अच्छी संस्था फूड एंड न्यूट्रिशन सिस्टम हो सकती है कैन यू इमेजिन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन बेटर देन दिस इससे अच्छा कुछ हो सकता है और इसको डिफाइन किसी और ने किया हमने किया ना आप सबने मिलकर किया जो कि इसके पार्ट है तो डोंट यू वॉन्ट टू मेक इट लाइक दिस हाँ या नहीं देखो जनरली होता क्या है कि हम भगवान से वही मांगते हैं जो अपने बस में नहीं हाँ या नहीं भगवान में गए मंदिर क्या है भगवान आज मुझे एक रस पानी मिल जाए ऐसा कहीं मांगोगे ना यार मांगोगे भगवान आज जो है ना मैं शर्ट और पैंट पहन लू ऐसा थोड़ी मांगोगे यार भगवान आज जाऊं घर तो मुझे क्या हो जाए तो आप मांगो ऐसी चीजें आप ऐसी चीजें मांगना चाहते हो भगवान से 
जो कि तकलीफ दे है नहीं हो सकता है असंभव लगता है कठिन लगता है मुश्किल लगता है समझ रहे हो भगवान से आप जनरली ऐसी चीजें मांगते हो जो संभव नहीं लगता है आसानी से या असंभव सा लगता असंभव सा लगता है भगवान से भी मांगते हो ना भगवान से आम जो हमारे चीजें इजिली संभव है वो हम नहीं मांगते सही है एग्जैक्टली नहीं नहीं आई एम कमिंग सो दैट इज नहीं नहीं इसीलिए कह रहा हूं मैं कि जो हम भगवान से वही मांगते हैं जो कि कठिन है असंभव है असंभव सा है असंभव तो कुछ भी नहीं होता देखना इम्पॉसिबल बट असंभव सा है राइट ना इसीलिए वो चीज मांगना चाहते हैं नाउ लुक एट दिस दिस डेफिनेशन लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स आर एस्पिरेशनल थिंग ऑफ एनी एम्प्लॉय इन एनी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन नॉट ओनली सी एफ एन एस बट जब हम काम करने जाते हैं तो ये चीज भूल जाते हैं God helps those who help themselves. So if we, we are willing to help our, ourselves to make this, it will happen. Nobody can stop that. So Bhagwan ka vardhan milega, lagi tabhi milega jab aapki ichha hogi iske kam karne. Now jab humne kaha ki skill kya chahiye aapko ye karne ke liye, to aapne dekha ki thode se fumbling hui, kyunki aapne skill kya mangna shuru kar diya? Paad mangna shuru kar diya, wo chhi mangna shuru kar diya. Exactly hi hota hai. Karna ye chahte ho. लेकिन चाहते क्या हो कि हो जाए मैं तो आराम से बैठा रहा हूं चार पांच लोग हो ये हो यही समस्या हो जाती है लेकिन अगर ये करना है और भगवान ने साफ कहा कि अभी यह स्किल मांगनी है ताकत मांगो कि मुझे मैं ऐसी क्षमता दो भगवान मुझे पिनाकी धनुष दो मैं किसी को भी मार दू धनुष ही भगवान दे सकते हैं भगवान मुझे उसको मार दो ये नहीं कर सकते तुमको करना है मीन्स यू आर द मीन्स यू हैव टू डू इट समझ रहे हो आपके आपके हक में कर्म है काम करना है हमें बाकी फल तो देंगे ये लेकिन यहां भी आप फल मांगना शुरू कर दिया यही गलती हो लेकिन जो देखो जो भी हमने पॉलिश करके जो निकाला है एक्चुअली दिस इज व्हाट इज रिक्वायर्ड इन सी व्हाट यू नीड नॉलेज अनलिमिटेड मतलब वी शुड बी द सी ऑफ नॉलेज एनीथिंग टू डू विथ फूड एंड न्यूट्रिशन ओके लाइजिंग स्किल्स ओके so i'm i'm coming i'm just prioritizing things so first thing which is important is required is actually the knowledge cfns has to be the mainstream the of anything that is talked about food and rich we should be the store of knowledge agar kisi ko kale bhaiya food nutrition kuch puchna hai to cfns se puchna ye level chahiye hamara wo banane ke liye hame jo karna pade chahe wo expert banana pade aur aadmi aa jaye jo idhar bhi manga hai kuch logon se या जैसे भी करे रिसर्च करे करे हर आदमी उसको बिल्ड करे हर आदमी उस तरह से काम करे कि इमेज इस तरह क्रिएट हो ये बंदे जो हैं सीरियस हैं जो बोलते हैं इस वेल रिसर्च एंड ऐसे ही नहीं बोलते दैट्स द फर्स्ट पार्ट ब्यूटीफुल आई थिंक यू डू इट आई थिंक आपने 15-20 परसेंट ये एड्रेस कर दिया होगा ही पक्का हो जाएगा अगर ये आपने कर दिया तो इसमें भी आपने कहा कि हम जो है हेल्थ न्यूट्रिशन में फूड न्यूट्रिशन में चाहते हैं देन आपने कहा कि भगवान हमें एक ऐसी एडवोकेसी स्किल दे कि हम एडवोकेट कर सकते हैं यानी कि हम जो कहे किसी को कहे सो दे गेट कन्विंस्ड वी कैन एडवोकेट एनीथिंग विच इज गुड इट्स एक्सेप्टेबल जब ये हमारी स्किल अच्छी हो जाएगी ऑब्वियसली हमें ऑल लेवल विल गेट एक्सेप्टेड लोकल लोग ग्लोबल सब हो जाएगा ये चाहिए हम में हर आदमी में हर हमारा जो एम्प्लॉयज हैं वो एक हैज टू हैव अ वेरी गुड एडवोकेसी स्किल ही शुड हैव अ वेरी गुड यू नो राइटिंग स्किल यू शुड हैव वेरी गुड लाइसनिंग स्किल ये स्किल्स जो हैं हम में आ जाए Obviously, will accomplish what is it to be done? Then it says you know, align with the thinking of the entire organization. मतलब क्या हम में से हर आदमी जो है जो संस्था की सोच है जो एक्सपेक्टेशन है उससे align हो जाए. So संस्था की जो vision है that becomes a shared vision of all the employees. And unless it is a shared vision, we make an amoeba organization only. You cannot make an unified, fast running organization. You cannot make it. जाना इधर है कुछ लोग इधर जा रहे हैं कुछ इधर जा रहे कुछ इधर जा रहे हैं तो संस्था चलेगी आगे नहीं चलेगी ना बट दिस इज अ ब्यूटीफुल यू नो स्किल दैट एक्चुअली यू आर आस्किंग एंड आई थिंक इट शुड बी देयर इन ऑल ऑफ अस देन यू आर आस्किंग यू नो ओनरशिप विद द फुल कमिटमेंट फर्स्ट क्लास आई थिंक हम में से हर आदमी पूरी तरह से कमिट होकर एक ओनरशिप मोड में काम करे कि मेरा काम है करना ही है चाहे जो हो जाए आई थिंक व्हाई नॉट ऑल दीज रिजल्ट्स आर टू बी अकम्प्लिश नो प्रॉब्लम देन एक्सीलेंट इन्वॉल्वमेंट विद द Task and actually communication skill हमारी बढ़ा दो no problem excellent negotiation skill कर दो no problem and committed and dedicated हमें बनाओ जो भी हम करें with full commitment and dedication के साथ काम करें now tell me if 
these things happen in each one of us these skills are available is something unachievable hai koi cheez par ye ye vardan kuch bhi nahi hai uske samne yaar tum karte dikha do ye cheeze ye karke dikha do ye apne aap ho jayega and it will happen sooner than later i am telling you but this is very important it requires some sort of sacrifice some commitment dedication some greed of all of us and if we have that gumption that we can do it i think we'll do it we'll make it but wo cheez dikhani padegi hum mein himmat hai to hum ye kar sakte hain ye jo skill set hain likhe gaye hain ki hum mein se har koi prayas karega ki kam se kam ek saal ke andar mein in mein se kuch skill ko main ab jis level pe hu usse main kam se kam 30 40 50 60% higher skill ko leke jaunga aaya jaunga try that and see how we are enabling the organization not you only you are enabling the organization to achieve all that we have and this becomes the dream and we'll make it happen this becomes the vision we'll make it a reality but what is required is all of us ye kisi ek ke liye nahi tha ye jo aapke skill se kisi kisi se dimag mein aaya lekin many times mai bol raha tha na projection many times i know yaar adhiktar logo mein ye cheez nahi hai lekin mai bhagwan mujhe hi de de aisa bolunga ताकि कंपनसेट हो जाए तो एक्चुअली क्या ये किसी एक की नहीं थी आपको दो ही मांगे गए थे इसकी अगर मैं कहता कि दिन भर बैठ के लिख तो हर कोई यही चीज लिख देता आपको पांच स्किल मांगने आते आप सब यही लिखते दो दो मांगा मैंने राइट right, ना लेकिन कलेक्टिवली एग्जैक्टली टेल मी एनी स्किल विच इज नॉट रिक्वायर्ड विच इज रिलेंडेंट है इसमें कोई और कोई भी ऐसी स्किल है जो कि हंड्रेड पक्का है एनी वन ऑफ अस नॉट ए सिंगल सोल ऑफ अस so now tell me on this set if you are at actually 20% then how do you want to make it here a 100% hoga hi nahi na actually wahan 20 hai yahan par aap 5% mein rahoge ye hamesha yaad rakhna agar wahan par 40 se hoga to yahan par ja kar ke 15 20 mein aaoge because each one is an expert a cricket team best bowler best batsman and still they lose the match because bringing everything in sync playing as a team that's a different ball game so that takes time isliye har ek ka 20 20 jo hai net result jo ho jata hai kitna ho jata hai 20 into 20 into 20 0.2 into 0.2 ho jata hai to 0.0 mein chala jata hai so i think here we have to be trying to be above you know 80% all of us then actually we make good organization because agar do log kaam karte hain 18 20 60% chala jata hai बट इसमें से एक आदमी भी 100 परसेंट पर है तो खींच के 80 परसेंट लेकर चला जाएगा हर कोई 100 हो नहीं सकता है संभव ही नहीं है लेकिन 80 90 में हर कोई ट्राई करता है कुछ तो होंगे जो खींच के लेके जाएंगे तो लेट ईच वन ऑफ फर्स्ट ट्राई टू बी एट द पिक ले ऑफ ऑल द स्किल दैट वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट सो आई थिंक दिस शुड बी आर एक्चुअली आर प्रेयर दैट दीज आर द स्किल्स वी वॉन्ट मे बी लिस्ट इट ऑन पॉलिस इट राइट नाइसली दैट ईच इंप्लॉइंग सी एफ एन एस विल वर्क टूवर्ड्स मास्टिंग दीज स्किल्स फर्स्ट तो मैं बात करता हूं ऑर्गेनाइजेशन की कि हम एक अच्छी संस्था कैसे बन सकते हैं उसके पांच सेट होते हैं पांच चीजें होती हैं उसमें पहला आता है पर्सनल मास्टरी ईच वन ऑफ है मास्टर और सेट तो मास्टर किस चीज में होते हैं स्किल में मास्टर होते हैं एटीट्यूड में मास्टर होते हैं नॉलेज में मास्टर होते हैं ये तीनों चीजों को आपको सीखना पड़ता है उसमें मास्टरी दैट इज पर्सनल मास्टरी देन आता है नेक्स्ट स्टेज नेक्स्ट जब ये पर्सनल मास्टरी हो गई तब हम बात करते हैं टू हैव शेयर विजन व्हाट इज दैट वी वांट टू अचीव टुगेदर दैट्स अ सेकंड स्टेज एंड लेट्स डिफाइन इट आई थिंक यू हैव डन इट ब्यूटीफुल राइट सो हमारे स्किल सेट ये हो उसे मास्टर करना है विजन हमारा हो ये काम करना है नाउ अब आते हैं हम तीसरे स्किल तीसरा स्किल क्या है इट्स अ टीम लर्निंग हाउ डू वी वर्क एज अ टीम How do we learn from each other? How do we become an organization which is a learning organization? Have you read a book? If not, then please read it. It's the fifth discipline by Peter M. Singe. And what I'm talking about these five, he describes them. The fifth discipline, kitab ki naam hai, and it says, and a good organization is a learning organization, and what it constitutes. Okay, maybe that requires a full day to get into detail of that. Maybe sometime we will have some time. So, all right. You can get that book. पढ़ना शुरू करोगे ना तो खत्म नहीं कर पाओगे मैंने एक बंद नहीं कर पाऊंगे 
there are there are very few books that you open and you always get motivated to read it till end this is one such book okay so ye ho gaya aapka maine ye slide bhi bheji thi hamare sachin ko ki ye dikha dena us samay jab main baat karunga मतलब क्या था उसमें ऐड ओके देन आता है मेंटल मॉडल्स द फोर्थ पार्ट ऑफ मेंटल मॉडल्स का अर्थ होता है हर आदमी के अपने सोचने के तरीके होते हैं बिकॉज वो लाइफ में बचपन से लेकर आज तक जिस स्टेज पर आया है उसको उस सोचने का उसका एक मॉडल बन गया है तो कोई भी घटना होती है कोई भी चीज कही जाती है तो उसको अपने मॉडल से सोचता है जो मैं कह रहा हूं हम हर कोई उसी ढंग से रिसीव नहीं कर रहा है हर कोई अपने अपने फिल्टर लगा कर रिसीव करता है समझ रहे हो आप लाइक like करो या नहीं करो अगर कहा जाए ये हमने कई कितना एक घंटा सवा घंटा लगाया इसके बाद से कहा जाए कि ये घंटे में आपने क्या हुआ क्या सीखा लिखो जरा आप सबके जो ऐसे होंगे एकदम अलग अलग होंगे बिकॉज हर कोई अपना एक फिल्टर यूज करता है समझ रहे हो आप बात को तो आप देखोगे अगर किसी प्रति आपके अंदर में ट्रस्ट है नहीं भैया ये आदमी तो अच्छा है तो जो बोलता है उसके ऊपर आपको देर इज अल्फ कंडीशनिंग द माइंड हु स्टार्ट एक्सेप्टिंग इट नहीं यार ये सही कर रहा है अच्छा है अच्छा है समझ रहे हो आप जब कभी बहुत तकलीफ में होते हो तो सलाह लेना होता है किसके पास जाते हो जिसके ऊपर आपका ट्रस्ट होता है ऐसे के पास नहीं जाते आपका क्रिटिकल है जाओगे कभी उसके पास लेकिन जाना उसी के पास चाहिए निंदक नियर है राखी आंगन कुटी छवा है लेकिन वो लोग कहने की बात हो गई ना कबीरदास की मानता कोई नहीं है तो किसके पास जाते हो जो आपके लिए बहुत ही आपका बहुत जो जो सुनता है समझता है आपको हाँ करता है ये करता है गरीब यही है तो जो फिल्टर हमने लगाया है अपने अंदर उसके अनुसार हम सब कुछ रिसीव करते हैं यही बोलता है मेंटल मॉडल्स को क्वेश्चन करो मेनी टाइम्स वी जंप द लैडर एंड एक्चुअली कम टू कंक्लूजन इज एक्चुअली रॉन्ग और ऑपोजिट ऑफ वॉट एक्चुअली दॉट वॉज मेंट तो मैं बार बार कहता हूं कि हम जो भी कहते हैं जो भी बातचीत होती है तो मैं कहता तो ये हूं जो कि मैं लिखना शुरू करूं तो दो कॉलम बनाऊंगा एक लेफ्ट हैंड कॉलम एक राइट हैंड कॉलम राइट हैंड कॉलम मैंने जो कहा लेफ्ट हैंड कॉलम में जो मैंने सोचा था तो आप देखोगे कम्युनिकेशन में लेफ्ट हैंड कॉलम जो इतना बड़ा हो जाएगा कि लिखने की जगह नहीं बचेगी राइट हैंड कॉलम में इतना ही होगा है ना क्योंकि हम जो भी अंदर सोचते हैं वो सब बोलते नहीं है क्योंकि बोलने वाले तकलीफ हो जाएगा सुनने वाले को नहीं है कि नहीं है या नहीं भैया आज का क्या है भाई जगह कहाँ है कहाँ पर खाना जाना है देख लो उसमें भेजा ना व्हाट्सएप में भेजा हुआ है ग्रुप में कहना क्या था इज नॉट हेयर बट आई एम टेकिंग लिबर्टी टू से ही वॉज टेलिंग दिस फेलो मतलब देखता कुछ है नहीं पूछता है खाली है तो खान जाना कहा देख ले पूछ ले ये क्या था अरे ये ये कुछ करता नहीं बताता नहीं ये मौका है सबके सामने जरा सा एनी वे अगेन माई माई मेड यूजिंग फिल्टर बट मैं कहना है आप समझाने के लिए मैं कह रहा हूँ किसी आक्षेप नहीं है so 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 exactly exactly so there is a left hand column. there is 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 a a left left hand hand column column which is much larger than the right hand column. and actually these mental जो मॉडल्स होते हैं मेंटल ब्लॉक के रूप में जाना जाता है तो ये हमारे जो मेंटल ब्लॉक होते हैं हमें एक टीम के रूप में काम करने में वेन वी वर्क टूगेदर आई थिंक वी हैव टू ब्रेक ए लॉट ऑफ दिस मेंटल मॉडल्स विच वी हैव अर्न ओवर दर्स मुझे हटाना है एवरी टाइम इज ए फ्रेश टाइम आई गिव यू अपॉर्चुनिटी एवरी टाइम आई नो सचिन ने लास्ट में ऐसा किया था वैसे किया था ठीक है तो ठीक है यार हो गया उसमें अब ही इज अ डिफरेंट मैन एंड आई हैव टू स्टार्ट अप फ्रेश इतना आसान नहीं है क्योंकि ह्यूमन बाय टेंडेंसी एक्चुअली वर्क्स ऑन द सिंपलिसिटी नॉट ऑन कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी हर चीज कॉम्प्लेक्स को हम सिंपलीफाई करके कहने को लेते हैं आपके बारे में मुझे पचास ये पता है लेकिन एंड रिजल्ट में क्या कहूंगा सुब्रतो अच्छे आदमी है या सुब्रतो अच्छे आदमी नहीं है और उसके अनुसार मैं डील करूंगा सुब्रतो या एनी बडी फॉर दैट मैटर कैन नॉट बी एब्सोलूटली गुड एंड एब्सोलूटली बैड हर आदमी इज अ पर्सन मिक्स ऑफ द टू लेकिन दिमाग ऐसे नहीं सोचता है मेरा उनके साथ डीलिंग अच्छा है नाइस पर्सन है तो जो बोलते हैं हम कर सकते हैं वो हमारा मान लेंगे हम उनका सुन लेंगे लेकिन उसी तरह से एक दूसरा आदमी है अरे वो तो जो बोलो वो मैं ना ही बोलता है यार वो कुछ नहीं करेगा हालांकि हो सकता है इस बार कर दे वो लेकिन दिमाग ने क्या मेंटल मॉडल क्या है ये नहीं माने इसीलिए हम अप्रोच ही निगेटिव करेंगे और एक्चुअली रिजल्ट भी होगा सेल्फ फुलफिल्ड प्रोफेसी हम इस तरह से क्रिएट कर देते हैं कि उसका जवाब उसी तरह से आता है कहा था ना देखो ये आदमी ऐसा ही है बट एक्चुअली गलती उसकी नहीं है गलती मेरी है क्योंकि आई हैव बीन स्पोक एक्चुअली इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल थिंग द मेंटल मॉडल्स यू नो अगेन इट्स अ बिग थिंग एंड एक्चुअली आई कैन आई कुड हैव डेमोस्ट्रेटेड विद फ्यू एग्जांपल्स हियर इटसेल्फ हाउ इट वर्क्स तो ये है चौथी चीज जिसको हमें की हटाना चाहिए अपने तरफ और पांचवी और अंतिम चीज है 
सिस्टम थिंकिंग सिस्टम थिंकिंग का अर्थ है कि कोई भी चीज जो है अपने आप में अकेली नहीं होती एवरी थिंग इज इंटर वन इंटर रिलेटेड तो जो भी आप करते हैं उसका एक का इम्पैक्ट कहीं और होता है है ना एक छोटी सी कहानी कही जाती है एक बार क्या हुआ कि एक कालीन बिछाई गई थी है ना तो कालीन बिछाई गई थी तो वहां पर कुछ बीच में उठा हुआ था कालीन तो एक बताता है ना क्यों उठा हुआ जाकर के पैर से मार दिया हुआ तो कालीन वापिस गया दूसरी जगह उठ गया फिर वहां तीसरी जगह उठ गया राइट तो ये समझ में नहीं आ रही है कालीन में प्रॉब्लम क्या है बट वॉट वॉज द प्रॉब्लम तो बोला भैया ये जो है ना ये केवल कालीन एक जगह ठीक करने से नहीं होगा पूरा कालीन उठाओ और एक बार फिर से बिछाओ पूरा कालीन उठा फिर से बिछाओ तो अंदर में दरवाजे स्नेक उड़ा तो बाहर निकल गया तो प्रॉब्लम वॉज दैट स्नेक विच वॉज मूविंग फ्रॉम हेयर एंड देर तो आप कितना बार भी ऐसे दबाते रहते नहीं चलता तो इसलिए कहता है सिस्टम क्या कहता है कि कोई भी चीज को सोल्व करना है तो पूरे उसकी कॉम्प्रीहेंसिव थिंकिंग होनी चाहिए सोचो क्या क्या उसके पार्ट है कंपोनेंट क्या होगा उसके अनुसार आप डिसीजन लो डिजाइन करो राइट अदरवाइज फिक्सेस विल कीप बैक फायरिंग जो फिक्स लगाओगे वो चलेगा नहीं साहब वो सुनता नहीं ये हुआ नहीं ये हुआ नहीं वहां गया तो उसने नहीं किया उसने गया तो उसने ऐसा नहीं किया ये चलता रहेगा सो सिस्टम थिंकिंग के पांच आर्च टाइप्स हैं जिसको कि हमें ध्यान रखना पहला फिक्सेस एट फायर जो भी फिक्स एक बार कर काम नहीं चलता है दूसरी बार फिर ऐसी प्रॉब्लम आती है इसका मतलब है कि देखो भैया देर इज स्नेकिदर डाउट तो देर इज प्रॉब्लम राइट लिमिट्स ग्रोथ बहुत समय ऐसा होता है कि हमारे अपने डिसीजन जो होते हैं हमारे ग्रोथ को रोक देते हैं हमारी सोच छोटी होती है हमारी डिजाइन छोटी हो जाती क्योंकि तो, तो वो जरा हमें ध्यान देने कहीं हम नई सोच में ही प्रॉब्लम तो नहीं है इसके कारण हम आगे नहीं बढ़ पा रहे हैं दैट्स कॉल्ड लिमिट्स ग्रोथ देन कॉल्ड एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी एक्चुअली हम दुश्मन नहीं है लेकिन एक्सीडेंटली बिकॉज ऑफ पोजिशन वी बिकम दुश्मन दैट्स कॉल्ड एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी टिपिकल इन ए सिस्टम फाइनेंस एंड द इम्प्लीमेंटेशन दे आर एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी फाइनेंस बोलता है पैसा नहीं है प्रोग्राम बोलता है काम नहीं करने देता है फाइनेंस बोलता है करता कुछ नहीं हमेशा पैसा मांगता है सो दे आर कॉल्ड एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी एक्चुअली प्रॉब्लम नहीं है बट दिमाग ही है हम तो यार ये अपोज करेगा और ये करेगा तो ये जो है एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी तो कहीं हम नहीं बना रहे किसी को ये सोचना चाहिए बस 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 तो एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी तो दिस इज अ प्रॉब्लम एंड वी हैव टू सॉर्ट इट आउट सो कैसे होगा मैं सोचूंगा कहीं मैं एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरी तो नहीं बन रहा हूं थिंक ऑफ दैट फॉर अ वाइल आई थिंक प्रॉब्लम इज गेट सॉल्व देन आता है ट्रेजडी ऑफ कॉमन्स वॉट इज ट्रेजी ऑफ कॉमन्स हर कोई सोचता है थोड़ा सा मैं नहीं करूंगा देर से कर दूंगा तो क्या अंतर पड़ेगा अरे मैं ही थोड़ा सा देर से जाऊंगा तो क्या अंतर पड़ेगा एंड एवरीबडी थिंक्स लाइक दैट एंड द होल सिस्टम एक्चुअली गोज लेट और डज नॉट हैपन टिपिकल एग्जांपल देखोगे आप चले जाओ हमारे बहुत सारे रूरल एरियाज में सोचते हैं लोग वाई शुड आई पे इलेक्ट्रिसिटी बिल और रात में देखोगे जैसे ही शाम होती है एक कागज तार उठाया उठा कर ऐसे लगा देते हैं और पूरे एरिया में सबके घर में बिजली जल रही है लेकिन मीटर कुछ नहीं चलता है <laughs> मीटर है ही नहीं बंद है डिफंक्ट है पेमेंट कभी किया ही नहीं है मैं थोड़ी बिजली चला लूंगा तो क्या होगा नतीजा क्या होता है सरकार पैसे नहीं दे पाती है उस बिजली का उसकी बिजली सप्लाई कम होती है और हर पूरी बस्ती में एरिया में वो दो घंटे ही पावर आते हैं ऐसे एग्जाम्पल हमारे ऑर्गेनाइजेशन में भी होता है यू हैव टू फाइंड इट एंड ट्राई टू फिक्स इट आउट सो दैट एनदर प्रॉब्लम ट्रेजी ऑफ कॉमन होना नहीं चाहिए जो होता है एंड द लास्ट एंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इज शिफ्टिंग द वर्ल्ड तो हर कोई सोचता है मेरे ऊपर ना आ जाए साहब उसने ऐसा कहा था उसको मैंने कहा था इसने किया नहीं वो बोले मैंने उसको कहा था उसको मैंने ऐसे किया नहीं टिपिकली आई वॉज सींग इन दिल्क देर इज सो वॉट विल द प्रोक्योरमेंट फेलो से साहब पैसा बढ़ाया नहीं तो किसान ने दूध दिया नहीं क्योंकि दूसरे ने ज्यादा पैसे दे दिए राइट तो प्रोक्योरमेंट कहेगा दूध नहीं आया फाइनेंस कहेगा हम कहां से पैसे दे साहब मार्केटिंग वाला बेच नहीं पा रहे कमाया नहीं है आवक है नहीं हम कहां से पैसे दे रहे तो मार्केटिंग पूछो सर मार्केटिंग कैसे कर रहे क्वालिटी इतनी थर्ड क्लास को देता है टाइम पर दूध नहीं देता है प्रोडक्ट नहीं देता है हम कहां से कहां से बेच पाएंगे तो क्वालिटी प्रोडक्ट वाला क्या बोलता है क्वालिटी वाला क्या बोलता है हम क्या करें सर ये जो भी प्रोक्योरमेंट आ रहा है थर्ड क्लास का मिल रहा है अच्छा नहीं है टाइम दे रहे हम कहा से क्वालिटी प्रोडक्ट देंगे फिर कहा है क्वालिटी प्रोक्योरमेंट पर सर हम पैसे ही नहीं देते क्या थर्ड क्लास ही नहीं खाएगा ना सो दिस होल साइकिल रिपीटेड एंड वॉट इज एंड रिजल्ट कौन जिम्मेदार है भाई हु इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल कैन यू फाइंड आंसर दिस इज कॉल्ड शिफ्टिंग द बर्ड एन मेरा एक एग्जाम्पल है एक्चुअली एवरीबडी ट्राइज टू बुलेट प्रूफ हिमसेल्फ आंसर हर आदमी ने बुलेट प्रूफ जैकेट लगा रखा है गोली चलेगी तो मुझे कुछ नहीं होगा 
और हर कोई जो है बुलेट प्रूफ लगाए हुए हैं अभी इस कमरे में हम जो है ग्यारह लोग बैठे हैं सबने बुलेट प्रूफ लगा दिया और सब गोली मार रहे हैं तो कहा जाए गोली तो गोली जाएगी भैया संस्था में यहाँ दिवाले ये बिजली ये सब टूटेंगे ना तो एग्जैक्टली सेम थिंग ऑर्गेनाइजेशन वेर एवरीबॉडी शिफ्टिंग द बर्डन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन गोज टू डॉक्स राइट तो ये चीजें जो है हमें अवॉइड करनी चाहिए तो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू अचीव दिस एंड दिस आई टोल्ड यू देर आर फाइव थिंग्स यू टेक केयर ऑफ दैट एंड इन द फाइव थिंग्स लास्ट आई टॉक अबाउट द सिस्टम आर्ट टाइप सिस्टम थिंकिंग जो मैंने पांच चीजें आपको बताई पहला जो है फिक्सेस एट फायर फायर अगर होता है तो रो देखो जरा तो ये गलत तो नहीं बार बार मैं वही कर रहा हूँ हो ही नहीं रहा है कुछ गड़बड़ है सोचो फिर से सिस्टम कोई लोचा है तो ऐसा तो नहीं है कोई सांप घुसा हुआ है और मैं खाली यहाँ पर दबाया जा रहा हूँ देन कहा कि क्या कहा सेकेंड लिमिट्स टू ग्रोथ मेन समथिंग माई डिसीजन इज एक्चुअली लिमिटिंग माई ग्रोथ माई स्टेट ग्रोथ माई ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ग्रोथ वो तो नहीं है क्या है भाई मैं ग्रो कर सकता हूँ लेकिन मेरे को कम्युनिकेशन अच्छा होना चाहिए लिखने की स्किल होनी चाहिए मेरे नॉलेज बढ़ना चाहिए और भी स्किल मैं कर पाई नहीं तो मैं जिम्मेदार हूँ अपने खुद के ग्रोथ का संस्था भी चीज एक्टली हुई होती है इंडिविजुअल लेवल में वो संस्था के लिए वैलिड है एक्सीडेंटल एडवर्सरीज दुश्मन है नहीं लेकिन दुश्मन रोल के कारण डिफाइन हो जाता है ऐसे कहा ना फाइनेंस एंड प्रोग्राम नॉर्मली बिकम दुश्मन तो ये ये चेंज करना चाहिए माइंड थिंकिंग प्रोग्राम बोलता है फकोड़ वाला साहब बेकार है हर कोई अपने थोड़ा सा जी चुराता है और संस्था ही जी चुराने वाले बन जाती है वो फेल हो जाती है और सस्टेनेबिलिटी के लिए भगवान से मांगने लगती है क्योंकि अपने में क्षमता है नहीं भगवान आप ही कर दो ना भैया है हमें क्षमता तो ये नहीं होना चाहिए एंड उसके बाद क्या था The 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 last one is is shifting burden. burden burden end rail burden will shift to the organization and organization and will sink under the burden. And but actually we are not. So the ship will also ground. Right? तो the ship will also ground. Right? जो मैंने कहा ये basically ये पांचों का पहला लेटर एक एक साथ रखो क्या बनेगा फ्लैट्स राइट सो इट इज इजी टू रिमेम्बर फ्लैट्स सो अगर आपने जो है आंसर नहीं किया ये पांच चीजों को यू बिकम ए फ्लैट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन खत्म हो जाओगे ग्रोथ नहीं होगा जहां वही सब पार्ट रह जाओगे खत्म हो जाओगे सो प्लीज अवॉइड दिस जो फ्लो ऑफ फ्लैट्स इट्स अ फ्लो ऑफ फ्लैट इट शुड बी अवॉइडेड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू ग्रो इन द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन राइट सो this was my part of input i thought i should give to this group and i hope it was useful right and hope somebody is writing because this becomes our bible likha photo please photo ne likhna photo kitne bhi padhenge nahi powerpoint banane ke liye because photo khinch liya hai many times we are reading you know we are not exactly written that way so jo likhne baitho aur capture karne jaoge to aayega लिखो। so, तुमने कहा कि हमारा बिकॉज समथिंग दिस हैज बीन को क्रिएटेड बाय ऑल ऑफ यू इससे वैल्यूबल कोई चीज हो ही नहीं सकती मैंने नहीं लिखा ये ये आप सबने बताया मैंने जस्ट कैप्चर किया है इससे बड़ी चीज जो है इस ग्रुप के लिए समूह के लिए हो ही नहीं सकती है इससे को क्रिएटेड डॉक्यूमेंट एंड एक्चुअली इफ यू बिलीव हंड्रेड परसेंट इन इट वील मेक वॉन्डर बट क्या आर वी कमिटेड टू इट करेंगे हम ये क्यों भाई संजीव करेंगे ना ये करना चाहिए इट इज डूएबल करना चाहिए या करेंगे विल यू डू इट और इट इज शुड बी डन विच वन देंटेंस विल चूज हाँ ग्रेट कितने लोग आई बोलते हैं शुड बी डन है और कितने लोग बोलते हैं विल डू इट अरे ये तो सुडमी उठा रहा था तू हाथ अब ये सुडमी उठाता तो फिर इट विल टेक अनदर हाफ एन आवर टू एक्सप्लेन व्हाट इज द मीनिंग बिहाइंड द शुड बी बट अभी नहीं स्किप कर अच्छा फोटो नहीं आ रहा था ओके सो आई थिंक लाइट कर दी है वी हैव डिफाइंड द विजन इन आवर ओन वर्ल्ड and and let's try to make it a reality and karna karte hai. Ek -ek step step by step, we should work on it. 
इसको हम जो है एक बार बैठ करके आई डोंट नो इज इट पॉसिबल दैट यू नो मे बी ये जो भी है कैप्चर कर लो आप लोग कैन यू स्पेंड सम टाइम एंड प्रायोरिटाइज दिस यू नो कि भैया हम वन नंबर क्या होना चाहिए टू थ्री फोर फाइव and all of us together tomorrow let's finalize it yes. this is what we want to be and top 1 2 3 4 and that will also uh, come into a form of like you know ps um, yeah it will lead to that it will lead to that so over i think then it can be broken into a milestones of three years or one year or what that will be as a second stage but the first stage is this second stage that also prioritize these are the skills that required in each and every uh, officer of the cfns and let's that also rakho usko bhi prioritize karo and let's start working from today itself only so isko zara kar lete hain kal ko hum finalize kar denge once you finalize statement that will be statement you will so call I, I type karke rakho so ab uh, this is a homework what you should do is that you please capture it in your uh, phone or notebook and reflect on it चीजें हो ताकि एक ही चीज बार बार ना है तो मान लो पांच चीजें हम इसमें से छह चीज आनी है कौन सी है और क्या ऑर्डर होगा और दूसरे में स्किल सेट हमारे अगर पांच छह सात चाहिए कौन से किस ऑर्डर में and make it concise okay uh, and that will say tomorrow with all of us all of us agree that becomes our bible to work towards mm-hmm. per, per, personal mastery mein bhi wo karna hai aur vision mein ye do component hum cover kar lenge okay so thank you, you co creation of our so sab individually this is the homework hmm? aapko mein jana nahi aadha aadha ek baar pad loge padne ke baad ग्रुप हाउ डू रिकैप कैसे करेंगे हम तो रिकैप हम सुबह में जब हम बैठेंगे मिलेंगे बात करने के लिए इच वन इज एक्सपेक्टेड टू स्पीक कि हमने आज क्या किया है होल डे में तो आप बोलेंगे हर कोई हर चीज बोल नहीं पाएगा पांच चीजों को बोलेगा पांच तो हर एक को मौका मिलेगा एंड स्लोली विल गैदर टूगेदर वॉट एवर यूर लर्न जो मिसिंग है दूसरा एड करेंगे सो दैट नथिंग गेट्स लॉस्ट राइट ना एंड देन एट द एंड ऑफ इट दिस इज द आउटपुट दैट शुड बी प्रेजेंटेड एट द एंड ऑफ दर ये जो दोनों स्टेटमेंट का फाइनल जो होना चाहिए वो प्रेजेंट होना चाहिए जो कि सेफरेंस की हेड टीम इज द रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर एक्चुअली प्रेजेंटिंग डन अच्छा सो टास्क वन हो गया रात के लिए मैंने होमवर्क के लिए अभी वी हैव व्हाट टाइम वी आर सपोज टू क्लोज 6:00 सो वी हैव 30 मिनट्स 30 मिनट्स में आई वांट टू आंसर व्हाई ए क्वालिशन बन गया क्वालिशन इज ए नेटवर्क उसको रब कर दें अच्छा ठीक है वेरी गुड सचिन है डेवलप्ड प्रेजेंटेशन वो प्रेजेंटेशन सबको शेयर कर दिया जाता है वो भी आप थोड़ा दैट इज बेसिकली ये जो आप एक्सेस कुछ और हां 57 57 से ज्यादातर सुबह डिस्कशन में कवर हुआ है बट वी विल स्किल स्पेसिफिकली विल टॉक विल टॉक वेरी स्पेसिफिकली एंड आई विल आंसर द क्वेश्चन more importantly and some questions so problem mein ja kar us ko likh lo ko ab the why a coalition is bhi aayega isme kuch aur some more points to come Thank <laughs> you.
Actually, today we started very, very good. Starting was good. The what time you started? Today? 10 15 we started. This from my place is far away. I started with the day. Among, uh, you came when Hemong was speaking. I think I think I'm the Hemong finished. Yeah, here. He had made a very good presentation. You can have his presentation. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and in fact, he it was very encouraging. He was not uh, confining himself to the project. Yeah, अच्छा are you pen drives or lelo? The pen drive is the bad dark pen drive. Pen drive load curve. What is the load? 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 What ये जो श्रीराम जो एग्जांपल दिया ना सर मैंने बोला था वो दिया नहीं सर वो मांगा नहीं हम्म ये जो सिंड्रोम है ना शिफ्टिंग द बॉटम सिंड्रोम कम से कम आप सोच पाएंगे ना कि ये हो क्या रहा है आई कैन यूज दिस लैंग्वेज कैन बी यूज्ड यार में क्या होता था एक शिफ्टिंग का सिंड्रोम मैं उस टाइम में उत्तर दे लो पोर्ट आता है इंपोर्ट इंपोर्ट होके आता था एंड देन पोर्ट पोर्ट में आएगा पोर्ट के बाद पोर्ट में फूड टेस्ट होगा और टेस्ट होने के बाद इफ इट क्वालिफाइज दी हमारा इंडिया गवर्नमेंट का स्टैंडर्ड्स ले होगा तो क्या उसको बोलते हैं क्या स्टैंडर्ड हाँ इसको स्टैंडर्ड नाम है वो भूल गया सही सही फूड सेफ्टी स्टैंडर्ड हाँ कुछ एक उसमें अलग था अभी तो एफएसआई हो गया है ना एफएसएसआई अभी उसमें कुछ और था फूड सेफ्टी स्टैंडर्ड था कुछ स्टैंडर्ड का नाम था वो अभी भी है बट वो स्टैंडर्ड को क्वालिफाई करना चाहिए मतलब इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड तो ये पोर्ट में जो पोर्ट हेल्थ क्लीयरेंस निर्णय पड़ता है ना इसको कंप्लाई करना तो ये पोर्ट हेल्थ अफसर है तो ये पोर्ट पोर्ट में पहुंचने तक क्लीयर होने तक इधर रिस्पांसिबिलिटी ऑफ क्या है जैसे पोर्ट पोर्ट क्लीयर हो जाता है देन इट गेट्स ट्रांसफर टू गवर्नमेंट रेस्पेक्टिव स्टेट गवर्नमेंट � और स्टैंडर्ड डिक्लेयर कौन करेगा पोर्ट हेल्थ अफसर जो पोर्ट हेल्थ अफसर को कौन देगा फूड टेस्ट करने के लिए केयर केयर कैसे देगा केयर हैज गॉट अपॉइंटेड है लेनिंग फॉरवर्डिंग एजेंट एंड सर्वेयर तो दे विल कलेक्ट द सैंपल फ्रॉम द शिप बिफोर इट गेट्स अपलोडेड विल कलेक्ट द सैंपल बिकॉज़ अपलोड भी परमिशन नहीं मिलेगा तब तक ये प्रॉपर स्टैंडर्ड नहीं तो शिप से स्टैंडर्ड सैंपल कलेक्ट करके उसमें देगा लैबोरेटरी पोर्ट हेल्थ लैबोरेटरी पोर्ट हेल्थ लैबोरेटरी तब क्यों डिले हो रहा है क्यों सिर्फ मट के डेमरेज चढ़ता रहता है क्यों इतना लंबा होता है सबसे ज्यादा डिले होता था कालकटी क्या है जब इन्वेस्टिगेशन के पता लगा कि पोर्टल दफ्तर को पूछा पूछा गया मीटिंग में गवर्नमेंट ऑफिसर जॉन सेक्रेटरी ने कहा क्यों डिले हो रहा है इतना खर्चा होता है सर क्या सब � why do you give a sample? Why do you give a sample? 
ना साहब हमने तो उनको चिट्ठी लिख के बता दिया कि जहाज पहुंच गया सैंपल रेडी है आप कलेक्ट कर लो क्योंकि सैंपल यू कैन नॉट गो एंड हैव टू कमेंट कलेक्ट बिकॉज वो कम यू कैन मैं यू कूड माली मैनिपुलेट सो दे इन योर प्रेजेंस दोट हेल्थ ऑफिसर हैज टू कलेक्ट सब तो केयर से पेशेंट है बोलते हमने तो नोटिफाई करते हैं कि सिप आ गया सैंपल आके आओ कलेक्ट करें वो आते नहीं वो बोलते हैं कि सर सैंपल हैंड ओवर करना रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी तो केयर का है अरे बाबा केयर का रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी हैंड ओवर करने के लिए लेकिन उसके बीच में एक है केयर कैसे सैंपल कलेक्ट करो वो सैंपल कलेक्ट करने का रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी पोर्ट हेल्थ ऑफिसर का वो डिस्चार्ज करना नहीं चाहता है वो पासन ब्लेम कर देता है केयर का ऊपर वो अल्टीमेटली जब अंदर अंदर घुसने के बाद शिफ्टिंग दॉर्डर केस आया कि पोर्ट हेल्थ ऑफिसर इज नॉट using its when he is not performing his role as stated in the protocol so then the danda laga pura ek circular gaya so all port health up to within 3 days of the notice sample will be collected physically by a person sent by the port health officer and or his representative in the presence of so and so but this is common sense this could, it could not it, 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 a, a notification was not necessary but the system ka itna इशू है कि लिखना पड़ा तो एनीवे सो लेट अस स्पेंड नेक्स्ट थर्टी मिनट्स सो व्हाई ए क्वालिशन मॉडल व्हाट व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस दिस वन गिव्स ये लिख दिया था ना सब क्वालिशन इज ए ऑर्गेनाइजेशन बट क्वालिशन इज नॉट एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू एग्री एंड डिसएग्री इफ आई से क्वालिशन इज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड इफ आई से क्वालिशन इज नॉट एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन क्वालिशन इज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू से दैट यस आई एग्री दैट क्वालिशन इज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन it doesn't make this kind of sense in that sense uh, agree so they are agreeing with the second point so coalition is different coalition is a organization but different from a typical organization so that's why it's called coalition is a network coalition is a organization of organizations coalition itself स्टिक्स the civil society organization development actors organization who are also a development player their ngos registered ngos and things like that and institutions i am trying to differentiate they are also organization but a, 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 a institution which is knowledge institution like suppose you are working with nil working with uh, uh, icai working with iica these are institution tomorrow we will work with a private uh, kolavarti sarvan hospital uh, the center of excellence so there are these are institutions but there then they may not be a member of the organization but there are institutions who are associated with 
this network. Government, government is an, not an organization, but government is an institution. And government is also associated with this through a different mechanism by which this is a part of the network. Like government cannot be a member or can be a member. Like there are coalition where government was a member, but it was a decision taken at the highest level. Like spear that humanitarian coalition, government of India is a member. They wrote that government of India is a member, will be represented by National Institute of Disaster Management. So by virtue of it, it became a member. But that, that needs for a very senior level, top level decision and all that. But we have got the government associated with this coalition in different manner, in a couple of ways. One way is that we have got the government agreed to nominate representatives to, to its board, both at center and state. Four nominees are there from the government in the board. So that is government ownership because the governance, governing body is a de facto a, a kind of owner of the organization or a kind of a policy maker or a governance actor of the organization. So government is also part of that. So this is one. And the second uh, instrument uh, association is that we are getting into MOU with the government entities. We are signing MOU with the Odisha government, Assam government. Uh, uh, then we are signing MOU with the uh, we are proposing to say, sign in with uh, IICA, uh, maybe with NIN, maybe start working with like that. There are many actors who are playing a different, uh, important role in the food and nutrition sector, like uh, IARI, USA Institute. We are also talking. So there will be some kind of association of engagement with those government institutions. There may be a private institution, like we are talking about. Uh, with uh, we have a partnership with Jindal's. Jindal is a member. Jindal CSR is a member. Through that that membership, we'll talk to Jindal School of International Studies. They have they also do a lot of research, uh, documentation, analysis on various aspects of development. So that we will discuss and then say if you're interested, it's a private institution, but it's a policy institution. Their work is international, you know. So if they come, they find interest. They will work with us on some projects and all that. So the, the canvas, we have to explore, we are exploring the canvas in this manner that we are bringing various knowledge institutions. We are really getting development actors and, uh, and individual members. Because we have seen also that in, in, the, in the landscape, we have got a lot of individual talents. Like Mr. Bhaskar Gorwa. He is an individual. He was. He has been a, a secretary of government of India, a minister of food and agriculture. He was a planning commission secretary. He was a FAO advisor. Like that, he has got multiple. And he was a former agriculture production commissioner in, in the government of Assam. So that kind of background. He is the founder of that the concept of FS Asai. Hey, sorry, Asai, not that. SFS. Yes. FSSI. No, not FSSI. Hmm. That is SFSC. SFSC. Ah, that uh, small farmers consortium. Uh, Agri business consortium. Uh, so that kind of uh, some of the farmers field school. These are some of the ideas he is known for his pioneering work in, in those domains and all that. So he's a knowledge house. So unko individually unko capture kara gaya hai. And like that, there are several other people uh, who are also in the in the board. Eminent people there, known based on their <coughs> knowledge, position, and all that. Swaminathan, Swaminathan uh, was the founder. Swaminathan was a part of this coalition till his death. And Swaminathan is a part of the organization as a knowledge person, not as a government, not as a Rajya Sabha MP who was not a member. So we are still part of this, right? Swaminathan. This is part of the, so, so these are, so these are the uh, kind of, uh, kind of, uh, uh, membership to the organization. So that means in, in the CFNS coalition, we have uh, NGOs, we have knowledge institutions, we have individuals, and now we have created another category at the, um, uh, these are students of nutrition, food and nutrition. Like those students who are studying, uh, is it, are we, take, we are not taking by, Ignorance? No, no, no. We are not ignorance. 
we are not taking students means undergraduate students we are taking postgraduate students huh? post so postgraduate students and research scholars who are doing research on food and nutrition they can also be member and for them there is no membership fees and means you know, they, they are uh, they can be member they can be life member or will be no they, they cannot be life member temporary and not be life member and they can be member and they can be they, and they are voting member no we don't charge no, 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 no. they are voting member they no no voting so no other way i'll get 50 fellows you know become member just before your agm so i hope your bylaws take care <laughs> yeah, but it's like but why do you need to make them member uh, so basically to, to have a voice that they are working and they can share their is a platform so that kind of space the board decided uh, i think Uh, a couple of years ago, they took it. Let's encourage, encourage the. Maybe they can be a part of research board. Ha ha. Like like that was the whole idea. The idea they can start getting um, uh, internship in the CFNS. Actually, they should be different category of member. Maybe nominate or some such member. Yeah, we have to. They are their student member. I agree. Uh, so that they do not have any other right. No, no. All it depends. Uh, they are agree. IIT IIT people they uh, IIT Kanpur IIT Bombay Mumbai they, Mumbai they, 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 they work with us they did not work but IIT Bombay is an institution can become any way our member ah uh, they can be member but they have a center but for but you are talking about IIT Bombay as such or some students from there no so, students no, no there is a center there is a difference no there is there is there is a center for rural development in Mumbai IIT they I got associated with CFS yes. and then the students can they came and they work. And the Uttar Chetia is a product of that. So these are the kind of uh, uh, knowledge actors uh, who uh, are brought together to build this network. So this is network with a difference. It is not only right, and the, all the research scholars of the field sort of value to our organization uh, because uh, they are dedicated to the research work. If you ask all of us, they might not be able to because they have a lot of other responsibilities. Yes, yes, yes. So go, they can bring a lot of those insights into research. Like there are professors in the nutrition, there are members like uh, Kulkit Mathur is a member of our coalition. And all that. Member has got certain rights and privileges. Ha, yes, sir. Basis being a member, so they have a. If I am a member, then I have a right actually to decide how the governing body will work. Because the general body is the most powerful body of any organization. Yes. So is the case of CFNS. So the membership right come attended with a lot of you know actually you power and also the uh, responsibilities. So you cannot make a member a research scholar who is a member by the side you know he just becomes a member because then he is part. You are actually making him part of decision making. So are you prepared for that? My question was only limited to that. But it is a student member like uh, the. Like, uh, like there are many many associations who have got student members also. Uh, I think institutions of engineer, engineers also have student members. So some so this uh, the came this was provided by Dr. Swaminathan. Uh, he suggested that uh, let's have some young minds also to be a part of. The, we can categorize them as student member and they can contribute. So this idea came like that and it was adopted. Yeah, but same resource scholar. If he decides to become a member, is there something which disqualifies? Means he becomes a mem member, he pays it, he signs your application. No, he does. There is no charge. No, no, that's that's a different thing. If there is a no charge, then you are giving a some notional type of a membership. Hmm. But if I become member and I'm, I'm actually becoming uh, liable to all the roles and responsibilities, then actually I have to pay something. Yeah, yeah. You don't have a voting rights. Okay. But if he becomes, but the moment he becomes a member, and pays, member, then he becomes a, gets all the rights. Now. All the rights. So the the more the more important point I'm trying to make is that this is the organization of organization individuals committed to the uh, work on food and nutrition security in India, uh, and uh, since it is a uh, organization of organization in its bylaw or its policies, it is also have been mandated that it will not compete with the members. Because the moment you start competing with members, that means if member is doing something and the network is doing the same thing, then it is a conflict. So there is a conscious decision that we will do such work which is not conflicting in nature with the the member organisation. Like uh, one is that uh, if we do the same thing that they are implementing project, we implement project. Then it will be that means the uh, any project so. Um, 
ये ले लिया डब्ल्यू एच एस ले लिया वो तो हमको मिलने वाला था डब्ल्यू एच एस का अच्छा फील्ड प्रेजेंट चीज ले, ले लिया तो हमारे साथ तो कंफ्लिक्ट हुआ इम्प्लीमेंटिंग पार्टनर बट क्वालिशन हेज गॉट ए इम्प्लीमेंटेशन रोल टूवर्ड्स इम्प्लीमेंटेशन हाउ दो रोल फॉर इम्प्लीमेंटेशन डॉक्टर स्वामीनाथन हेज वेरी नाइसली आर्टिकुलेटेड इज ही से दैट क्वालिशन इज राइट प्लेस to initiate innovations and that's why he used to call that let us do action projects action projects means to identify you um, pick up an idea and build on this idea and try it on ground prove it pilot it and leave it for your members to take it this is one model another model is that you work with the uh, member organization the actual implementation they do you do the advocacy knowledge management and networking part of it so that you can do so that was the way that it mean that you know cfns cannot take up any implementation which is one of the no. aspirations of this Aspirations. group so how do you address that so that is what i am addressing that we will do it our, our work is limited to great uh, in getting involved in action project which will demonstrate viability of action. other other way you can talk about pilot project pilot, pilot. poc and pilot that we proof of concept karo and then pilot karo so proof of concept is one topic one issue will be one time then you cannot touch that can you you may get again coming to your point uh, look at any organization in the country either talk about unicef who or w h h hmm. Most of the operations, particularly they actually implement pilot projects, including me also. Mm. Like you know, I went to various states for various running the pilot projects. Once it is successful, then only we will scale it up. So in a way, also we can do the pilot projects. There is no any harm on that. No, pilot, pilot project. Pilot project. I cannot say that all the projects are pilot projects. No, same thing. You are doing again, again, and it's only no, pilot. How so, can it be? I am telling you, in, in pure nutrition space, you can you can run almost fifty pilot projects. I can tell you. Hmm. I am telling you. You can run a pilot project on potato also. No, but okay. Potato so it becomes a pseudo. You can run a hundred pilot project. I can tell you. There are ways we can do. Yeah. There will be number of scope. Number, number of scope. No, I am just trying to align this thinking oh. along with the vision what we have for the organization. What is the vision of organization? That is something we should be able to make a difference in the food and nutrition sector. You know, and you are the organization whose whose voice will be heard first. that is what probably we want to aspire yeah, to become yeah, yeah. but, but to if that is that is actually diluted by you know take up some project here and there and keep busy even 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 so without taking any pilot project also without having any project there are a lot of works to do in this uh... because the members are doing this yes. in fact our so, work our work is also members work members work is also I'm our telling, work. i'm telling you for example wh is struggling to implement this uh, i know those people i will talk to them i have been also trying to support them Lot of those projects not in this kind of funding also. Those projects are not being implemented only because of we are lacking in advocacy. Because various departments in MP, what do they do? They are not uh, connecting each other. Because if not, we are not coming together. You cannot implement a program. So we have like for example the the millet mission is in the hands of agriculture department in most of the states. Now it is to be implemented by the uh, either by the WCB or medieval program. So they are not connected. There are a lot of advocacy work so, to be done. Just to tweak little bit on this, yes. I'm just taking example from NDDB. You can also, I mean, relate to it. Mm. See, NDDB per se is not an implementation body. Absolutely. Right now, yes. it's a central body, basically to enable development of the dairy sector. Mm. Right. But the NDDB always had. a farm organization people who are expert in working in the field and any time they can take over any of the federation union and show that this is the way it should be done but that was possible only when they had hands on people who had worked in the field so maybe cfns should take up that role we have the people yes. we can we can support our these member agencies yes, yes, to implement yes. any project so we are not directly implementing other than the pilot and the whatever project okay or pocs and all that but we are here to help any of the member organization if they are faulting any problem There is a team to do that. Let's build that. Yeah, that, I think that's a very uh, appropriate yes. appropriate uh, idea that can be built into. I have a question from that. Mm -hmm. 
अपने After all, they are our members only. So members collaborate directly. हमें issue तो नहीं होना चाहिए. We make that connection. Digital gain प्रदान में तो लोग तो बेहतर. ठीक है हमारा. If they don't want, it's fine. What is our role? Yeah, why? 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 Uh, a lot of those areas which is the organizations are struggling right now. For example, I am giving one example. The pay increases has a lot of funding right now for the minute, for example, in both the states, MP and. Uh, but despite of having funding, uh, they are facing struggles. Last two years, I have been seeing that they are struggling to manage uh, all the departments, and that is why we have stayed. We can reach out to any secretary, then we can convene those things. We will facilitate with certain cost to you. We will facilitate those things, and then we will call. That's the advocacy piece we are taking entirely advocacy piece. So, and believe me, working with any program, especially in food and nutrition, without advocacy, you cannot deliver the program. That is the experience I have got last fifteen years. Yeah, advocacy is a big piece. Big they make our not only advocacy, even this. All organizations are not pradhan. No, har koi ka outlook hoy nahi hai. No, unka apna mental model hai. But there are many organizations which will actually like to approach you. Please, unke saath connect kara do. so i think we should be open to that you know there'll be all that you know and mera apna manna hai ki cfns should not actually focus only on advocacy ah. i think you should have a people who have certain expertise to deliver anything in the ground and that should be a strength of cfn actually advocacy is the result of that i have 10 people who are expert today ndtv on dairy sector if the government wants advice first thing goes to ndtv why because the people who have demonstrated it you know from a 22 20 million metric ton they have brought to 220 million metric ton so whose voice will not be heard so exactly cfns what is there behind our legacy whom we can feel shine and say that we have done it if there is nothing then nobody will listen to our advocacy so for advocacy you have to have a solid strength of backing you that this is what we have done and for that you need experts people sitting here in this room we have to be very smart about doing this mr dr power from unicef he was talking about there are a lot of niches there are a lot of actor rubi then we can pick up the people who are putting us also telling the same thing organizations that doesn't, doesn't interact with each other hmm. i am telling you the big organization doesn't interact with them they do they are not right. like the realities of the ground realities they, they are very competing in nature they are they are very competing in nature you need someone not talk because of the ego issues why should i talk to these organizations so you, you know gi did you you heard it when we talk to the agent they say no 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 you sir <laughs> they don't want to engage other organizations that's where our our, exactly. our our role is very important and when we will be hard by the organization when we we have a full knowledge and expertise understanding why this uh, project is failing why nutri kadal project is facing uh, mm -hmm. a challenge why they could not to scale up with them this part of huge funding i know it's a huge funded program given by the giz But despite of all these things, last two two and a half years is going on. Why they couldn't be able to scale it up? There are certain because the advocacy piece is missing in that program. And I'm telling you, most of the organizations I have seen so far, they are very much focused on the program, managing the budget, managing the staff. No time for advocacy work. And that is how they end up. Once the project project is over, the program is closed. That is what exactly is happening in the country in poor neighborhoods. तो हम पहले से ये समझ बना के जा रहे हैं ना कि हम उनके साथ एडवोकेसी एफर्ट्स में पुलेट करेंगे तो हम एडवोकेसी करेंगे एंड उनके साथ उनको क्या करेंगे उनको ह
it will help you in uh, knowledge product development will help you in uh, advocacy and networking because this is well, I that organization not uh, uh, talking to each other they are not they're they're there. There. so that will and then uh, we have a the big strength as a convening power yes because of our multi stakeholder uh, institutional structure we have a huge convening power and when these uh, such uh, power is demonstrated by sharing some knowledge product, sharing some policy brief, or sharing some idea, then the chances of the policymakers adhering to this convening power is much greater than any individual. So that is, and uh, uh, and that is the strength we have to continuously harness. By which we will attract funding, we will attract attention of the policymakers. What Siram Singh bought today, in fact, that is one of the very powerful uh, add-on to that, that if we can be the last person or last man in terms of knowledge on food and nutrition security, either as a CFNS or as a, a CFNS, as a, 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 a kind of a resource pool. Like, say, you have this problem, Yes, we have got this kind of research pool, talents, we have got this talent pool, we'll be able to solve this problem. So how we we'll work on that? Uh, let us think about that. Let us build on that. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll have to do some projects. We'll have to work with some organizations, with some projects. They become a part of our talent pool. Something it needs. It is not in one hour discussion. It cannot be, but you have to think in the Because unless you have that, that solid power to solve problems, why people will come to us? Why policymakers will come to us? This is a very valid point. And we, the, like what kind of aspiration you all reproduced or expressed, and uh, if we have to fulfill that aspiration, then we have to work on this front. That we have to be really the last word on the uh, skill, last word on the talent. And I'm, I'm, I'm coming to the same point. Like, you know, there are many people who have blacked out today also. Uh, if you talk about, like, you know, when um, everybody is, Milak is talked about a lot. If you tell Kobe he's a office and talk about Milak, then you are nowhere. Because we know that Milak is not going to implement this program at all. But they have uh, other programs like uh, the SAM, SAM program. They are struggling with that in most of the states. If we talk about and focus your discussion on that part, definitely you are much aligned with uh, UNICEF. If you talk about food fortification with uh, WHS or other civil society groups, then you are inviting all uh, other uh, different uh, approaches, which they might not like to discuss with you. So we have to understand the dynamics, the, the politics of the organization, how they approach, which are the programs they are implementing. Let us focus into that and have a face to face discussion with them, bring much clarity. What's uh, our organization and UCM is going to do in the state? That first of discussion, face to face discussion has to be done to map out everything, discuss if you record a message twice, thrice, go and talk and clarify everything in, in that discussion. Then you have to concrete things to do with UNICEF, then you sit with other agencies. So, and then you, then you convene a round table discussion. Then it will be much better, I think. Once we have clarity of this. In fact, on the previous part, when I informed Dr. Kamil about the reason we are trying to hear the independent minister with the police and the election. So he did not completely reject that idea. No, but he was not enthusiastic. He was not interested. No, no, no. He was not interested. Let me complete it. It's not getting through for that. Mental brutality. So, but his point, what the positive sign I got from there was that, you know, you do whatever you want to do in Millet, but if that Millet model is somehow contributing to the change in the Sam child, is that there is some involvement on the activity component, then they no, will be happy to. Because I, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm attending all the, uh, for so many years, I've been attending, they have a, even only Kuji Universal also, they have a nutrition network body. Yeah. So they meet it every year. Mm -hmm. I visited so many times, discussed with them, because they have a PIP. Like yeah. you know, every year, what they are supposed to be is written much earlier. So they are not going to deviate anything. Funding is not spent, it's okay. But they are not going to deviate from their own agenda and doing something else. I don't think. Because only day I got clarified from the Arjun, who is the head of nutrition, uh, two and a half years ago, two years ago almost, 
uh, he has very clearly told me that uh, we are not going to risk, uh, you know, work on them. So we are not going to work on them. But so, so yeah. my point here is, so we are not involving investors in money in that. That's a separate activity. Mm -hmm. Question mm -hmm. is not money. Question is not money. Question is, uh, you know, we have to be much clarity in our partnership <laughs> yes. with different organizations. So, and then we have to develop our own mandate. Mm -hmm. What we are supposed to do in this case. So that is what because ultimately we have to position ourselves somewhere that why other organization UNICEF can go anywhere without us also. No, they're going. They're they're going. going. Yeah. And actually, we should also not be dependent only on UNICEF. Yes. And then our all our work is not uh, confined to UNICEF's uh, program. UNICEF program, UNICEF is uh, working with us only on this some child some Correct. program. Correct. Otherwise, they're not. Yes. And we are trying to bring out a relationship that look uh, working with uh, working on millet is going to be helpful because it will also provide micronutrients, micronutrients in the food and THR will improve. But we have to demonstrate that. Yeah. Is there any THR nice. model which using uh, millet? Maybe in the Pradesh we have. Maybe in some other state we have. So that kind but of I'm thing. I'm not saying that it is a not come. It is a come. Might might come much, much later, later. Much, much later. later. And I'm telling you, every whole country is talking about millet today. So we should have a part of our work into millet right now. Uh, the reason being, uh, except Odisha, not the state government should be able to do a good model or demonstrate anything. Like for example, in Rajasthan, uh, there are uh, the 50 percent of the millet production is happening only in Rajasthan right now. It's a huge production. Millet is you will not get any bajrega roti anywhere in the cities areas right now. It's very difficult. You don't get people have forgotten this bajra completely. It's given to the by uh, everywhere in the state right now. But Rajasthan is not acquainted with the whole ideas of what, what certain government is promoting. Now BGP came into power right now. I'm also trying to fix a meeting with the one minister. Uh, and and there is the opportunity. There is an announcement also happening that we have to restructure the entire millet program. And now question is right now. Uh, okay, the uh, government might have agreed. Then what could be an option for us? How we can promote it? We should have good, full knowledge about that. Yes. Standard supply chain. Now, there is no any processor. There is no millet processor. Why do you process it? Like Urisha, they have Bihar, Bihar skin, everything they have set up. It's not there in, in, in the state of Rajasthan right now. You won't find a single good processor who actually works on millet. So, not there. so, actually, the point is that uh, UNICEF is only uh, working with us on the one single project. Yes. But our the main donor chief you heard of Hemong. Hemong was much more holistic in terms of its expectation yes. from CFNS. Uh, he, he was not very confined to only he was talking about. In fact, he echoed that our focus on local food system. He echoed. So, so those are some of the positive signs. And uh, uh, we we are not we are not uh, we are not sign a uh, agreement that we will not work with anybody else other than UNICEF. We have got work with, and UNICEF also works on several projects. Sir, I have to say that the government is working on the same thing. We have to know what we need to do with each other. So, you know, at times what happens is... Right. Before doing anything, I'll be fast to very smartly understand you to find out what are the gaps in the program. What are the gaps in the policies. You can apologize for the good thing. Most of the things are happening in the implementation. What are the problems? Which are the areas? There are rationals, there are gaps. Then you see it with these agencies separately. Then, then they will give you value that you know everything about the program. No, let, let her listen to her. She has some points which is not completed. You are asking something. He, he got my point. Hmm. So, I have got 1,500 crore. But I am just in the closure I am discussing. I did only advocacy. And I have got the biggest money and I, am, I run the one of the biggest nutrition programs in the country. There, there are a lot of money. Because showcasing them, I have a DNA self, I have a WHO, I have a Bill Gates, I have a showcase, I have a state government. And if you have a budget program, I have got 300 crore from the state government of Gujarat, 200 crore from the Rajasthan. Sunny states in America. Last state I have walked to Haryana. I have a 100 crore. So it's not given to me to spend on the program. Ah, leveraging. So ye, this is our skills of network. If network is not there, I don't give anyone. I don't give anyone. I don't give anyone. It's the strength of the network. Right? Yeah, so, okay. Let's let listen to Anil. Uh, Anil. Sir, Hi. like uh, 
there are multiple organizations that right now are into the advocacy at secondary level. There are implementation organizations which are ready. In this scenario, if you are continuing to focus on the advocacy part of it, there is a lot of competition and there is a chances like the people are coming in and going out. Until and unless we have the implementation power and the knowledge from the bottom. Like server saying ki, we can have some expertise who can go and help us. But until and unless our uh, there there should be a practice ground for us there. Until and unless there is a practice right. ground, we have to go and represent someone's learnings, not our learnings. But uh, this is the difference between an individual one organization and a network organization. Exactly, exactly. So yes, suppose, suppose that, that just listen. Yeah. Uh, suppose, suppose I uh, go and advocate Vassan's war, like in Assam, what we are doing, we are advocating Vassan's war and saying that we will uh, together we will work with you to design and support your. Military program, military mission program. So, so there, Vassan is in the Vassan is in the forefront. We are not uh, taking yeah. our because we don't have anything. So, so th th what is wrong in doing that? that I'm not saying that, that is our uh, the point. He is making is you are, you are doing it because you do not have inherent strength within the organization on that. You've had probably you'd have gone all alone also. So then I would not have a network. If you have a different yeah, organization, network but because in a network, I do not want to compete with Vassar. Network is support. Right now, he said that there are multiple organizations working on the advocacy work. Yeah. There are multiple organizations also in uh, implementing projects. Who doesn't have the power of advocacy? He has the power of advocacy. If he has the power of implementation as well, that is a full fledged. Suppose, suppose I do uh, today implement a project which Vassar is doing. So, how fair it will be? In my analysis, it will be unfair that I am uh, yeah, competing with we, my organization. My member is implementing. You also have a split project. No, His way. idea is, I mean, if I understand correctly, is that you should build knowledge within the organization also, so that you your voice is heard at your face value. Not you always have to have piggy ride uh, Watson. Why if you have a piggy ride Raj Watson, then who listen to you? I mean, you are only uh, coming here to talk uh, somebody uh, other words. also comes from your member organization. That is, that is my point. My point is that different. Okay. So I am going to, because I say that it, since it's a membership-based organization, my member's performance, my member's competency, member's action is my action. And I am going to take them. And full acknowledgement of the member's capacity. Absolutely. 
सिंपल सर आईपीएल ऑप्शन ही दूंगा आईपीएल ऑप्शन में इफ वन प्लेयर देयर इज वन प्लेयर फॉर हूम एवरी आईपीएल फ्रेंचाइज इज पिचिंग फॉर क्यों उसके पीछे जा रहा है ये गुड प्ले उसके पास सब कुछ है इसीलिए वो कैप्टन भी है प्लेयर भी ओनली कैप्टन नहीं प्लेयर में इफ वी हैव दैट कैपेसिटी देन पीपल विल कम फॉर अस नाइ को दूसरा फ्रेंचाइज लेके जाएगा फील्ड वर्क राइट नो इफ यू से दैट एनी थिंग दैट इज देयर दैट एक्स मैन हु इज एक्सपर्ट उससे हम करवा लेंगे उसे करवा लेंगे तो एक्चुअली दे लूज द इंपॉर्टेंस यू नो सिटिंग दो जैसा आपसे भैया तू किस लिए है सो हाउ डज ही मेक हिमसेल्फ यू नो इफ से एडवोकेसी इन स्किल नॉलेज सम इंपॉर्टेंस टू सी फ्रेंड्स इटसेल्फ एज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ सम वैल्यू वो हम कैसे एस्टैब्लिश करेंगे ही इज लिमिटेड पॉइंट इज अगर आपके अपने आदमी नहीं है तो वासन का ही बेस्ट एक्सपर्ट को बोलो भैया हमें ज्वाइन कर ले यार so that at least i have a fellow who has got a credibility to talk about you know all these things whatever it is let let's come to the another point the very interesting debate going on uh, just one the example that what current you were engaged that we are working on we're starting the whs good practice we are uh, the signals are that it's a good practice worth replicating and scaling up with some body but naturally the context so it's not that uh, everything all solutions are there sarkar nahi hai sare golden sarkar ha so so those those things so the, every project has to be contextually redesigned modified to the situation so that it's understood there is nothing to be restated uh, this uh, this is essential part of any project design so if that good work which uh, uh, wh h had invested plus 5 7 years in doing that if we are able to create a knowledge product recognizing key features of this project and identifying its is the features for scale and making a making a significant impact in finding a solution it will go from 100 village to 500 village it will there another thing that saying that we are creating this model not as a independent uh, uh, ngo driven model we are creating a model which is driven by the, the public system also like panchayat they are bringing panchayat into it and all that so once you are creating something which is within the within the government involvement and civil society involvement and the the components of the program very well understood articulated practiced demonstrated and proven then are we not making a contribution to this society we are making i am not saying we are not making any contribution so here 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 is this is not mine but that doesn't satisfy his aspiration no, no. no i am coming to that i am coming i i'll suggest no this this is any this can you should be taken up maybe tomorrow because yeah. they have to go back and they have check out and yeah. go to secure hotel so let's yeah. not you know yeah we will we can talk this is, this is a point something probably tomorrow whole day we'll discuss still yeah, by the way we'll not come to a... in, 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 in i i mean i have worked in several coalitions and this is the issue which stay on result and i always exactly. insist that we will not compete with our own members because once we do but i am interested in practice unless you do practice how practice in action unless you have then on what basis you are championing it so i agree on that point so yeah, therefore yeah, i said yeah. that and that's why some dr swaminathan he, he, he was he was a part of this debate uh, dr swaminathan and he only told that we coalition should get into action projects and action project right. implementation yes. should be done by the member organization and with uh, cfns direct involvement with the uh, the organization implementing it so that you get hands on as to what is happening on ground but you don't implement it be like a ngo going and appointing your person in the village if you do that then your big mandate is compromised but action in practice must be there otherwise what basis you are going to submit so siram's point is valid your point is valid but a modality has to be worked out good so kaam karne ko milega chinta mat karo we'll drive things ah, don't worry yes, yes. Huh? 
Now, unless we drive, we don't learn. If you learn, then only you can become a good. Uh, unless you learn, you would not be able to drive. So we, we Chalo. I think let's break. Let's break. हर वोटर थैंक्स कल कल क्या करें आज क्या है अभी कल भी है ना कल है ना आज ही थैंक्स देते हो तो लोग चले जाएंगे फिर अच्छा कल देखो नहीं सुनो कल कल के थोड़ा ए ब्रीफ आई एम नॉट कमिंग कल नहीं आऊँ अब ठीक है आज जब हो जाए शाम को आ सकती है आधा घंटा बैक इन जाना फॉर सम ब्रीफ बिगनरस Will you articulate the logistics about that? Where will we go and what will the car arrangement be? Tell me all of them. You should not tell me. Tell me about where the hotel is, where the hotel is. What is the name of the hotel? What is the name of the hotel? Skyline Hotel. Skyline Hotel. Have you sent the WhatsApp? I have to check out the guest house. Go. There is a vehicle which will take you to the guest house. Pack your luggage, again get into the vehicle, go to Dwarka Sector 17, check in and come to the place for food. Food where will we go? Check in. After checking, we will get lunch. For lunch, we will get lunch tomorrow. Okay, for dinner. For dinner, we will get lunch at 8 o'clock. No, no, we will get lunch at 8 o'clock. We can't do that. नहीं नहीं क्यों नहीं तो नहीं 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 अरे जाने आएगा ना आप साढ़े सात साढ़े सात सेवेन थर्टी को जाकर हाँ ना ऐसा पैसा आएगा वो अरे पहुंच जाएगा खाते का दिन आठ बजे का सेवेन अरे नहीं नहीं वो जाएगा कैसे द्वार का ये सब चमार माले के चेक आउट कर दिखो यार फिर आओ यहाँ से साढ़े सेवेन सेवेन थर्टी आठ बज अभी अभी तक तूने ब्लू कैप काम किया अभी रेड कैप येलो कैप व्हाइट कैप सब बचे हुए हैं नहीं अभी कहाँ कहाँ जाना चाहते हो जाओ नहीं नहीं कोई होटल और कोई ऑप्शन है क्या आपके पास नहीं आराम से ही बोल रहा हूँ नहीं नहीं वहाँ से कि जब सेक्टर सत्रह इन सब को छोड़ने जाती रहेंगे तो वहाँ द्वारा में नहीं खाना खा लेते हैं मेरा दूध खा जाता है ना हमारा घर दूध पड़ जाता है एक ही बात पड़ती है आपको बाधा नहीं आएगा मेरा दूध शॉर्ट पड़ जाता है पैसे दूध पड़ते हैं पंद्रह मिनट आपसे जैसे आप तो क्यों फाइनल करिए थोड़ा चलो ठीक है, so it's fine here, don't no change. जाओ जाओ जाओ, फटा फट करके आओ। तो इल द्वार का जान कोई पेट ना खाए। ज़्यादा दूर नहीं है। नहीं घर जाके क्या करोगे? नहीं क्या मैं? You can sit here. हाँ। मैं तो बस। हाँ जी। कितने लोग हैं गाड़ी में कितने लोग बैठ पाएंगे? It is better to stay away from us. छह लोग आ सकते हैं गाड़ी में। इधर क्यों सिर खाएंगे हम अपने बस 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 बैठ जाएगा छह लोग से ज़्यादा है छह लोग ही हैं वहाँ यार ये यहीं छोड़ सकते हैं ना सब ना उठ के काफी कलर हैं छोड़ सकते हैं ना क्यों भाई अभी नज़र ओके यही छोड़ रहे हैं यार कल तो मिलेंगे ही ना सर मुझे सुनो कि प्रदीप सिंह सर तो ये जो जो स्टील ऑनलाइन क्या यार गुड 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 सुनो जी सर सब सुनो सब सुनो जी मज़रे नथी ली बट इट इज इन बिटवीन इट इज आई वाज लिटिल बिट आस एब्सेंट बट इट इज आई एम हेयरिंग ऑल दी थिंग्स बट इट इज ग्रेट 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 बुस्टर because we need to uh, internally we have to understand very clearly each other and uh, make a, as far as possible can make a common understanding so that uh, we create a vision for us ourselves and do things in a more business manner so, no it is i think it is a default default to invite us it is a i did a great default i think great default great default for whom for what for us, for me, I think that for it's, it's for staff and others. And it's, you are it's, missing something. Uh, but but this, is not a, this is actually, uh, that's why we said that uh, we'll uh, have some members online 
to share, uh, reflect, and share their vision, ideas, and uh, suggestions. Because you know we have always a limitation of budget. Um, we wanted the mentors to come and host organization to come. Uh, some of the host organizations came online, and some mentors also did not come because of their commitments and all that. So it is a staff, basically staff. But it's good that a lot of you are uh, uh, joining online. No, I learned a lot also because it's a, this is a good reflection. Okay. So we are trying to do it in a democratic um, process. Uh, let us hope that uh, it, it, it is understood and appreciated by our colleagues. Yeah, we always hope for the best. Mm. Okay, so it is okay. easy to set up an NGO, Call it but it is difficult to set up a network. No, no, sir. It's a, now today you are telling that we are the same principle we are practicing since long. Mm. Because we are not competing with our network members. Ah. Even if yeah, you, are, you, are small, you are a small network, local network. And how you are uh, giving the uh, autonomy to your members, not by not competing, but uh, adding value. The two, three partners, they are working in the same block, but we are not applying for this even if implementation of all this. Rather, we should keep a look from so all this, you know, this is the competing each other. But one point is, Swati, one point is very well taken, that unless you practice in action, then on what basis you say that this works. But my argument it, it, is that <clears throat> our members... Uh, 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 practice in action. Hello? No, this is, if you do practice, there are so many things you can you can come out with a good decision and good judgment sometimes. But it is uh, only this advocacy or this influence policy is matter. But you cannot learn this whole whole gamut of uh, the issues. So action project you can. जो मॉडल में कर कर अभी बात कर रहे हैं वही मॉडल चालू रहेगा देखते हैं क्या होता है हाउ देखो लेट्स सी बट इफ सम सम टैलेंट पूल यू हैव टू क्रिएट वी विल क्रिएट दैट टैलेंट पूल वी विल डू दैट बट समटाइम समटाइम डोंट ब्रेक द ब्रेक द this is the the vision and mission because it's, if it is not the action if you put put forcefully it may or may not be you know did you well. did are you there when uh, um, siram singh was uh, taking the session on vision goal yes it was uh, did you like it no, it's, it's, uh, this is a certain, certainly I like it, but these are not it's, it's a new concept because the new concepts are different. No, this is not new concept. This yes. is a participatory approach that uh, you do together, you create your vision together. And this is a very nice way. No, no, the, the, no, no he, has brought, he has brought all the things, very it's a left hand, right hand, all the things. But it's, I, I appreciate it, but it's... Uh, Okay, this is the re re reorientation of the staff, then it's, it's okay. But sir, it's the only thing that it, the, the organizations, they are not bringing this critical gap within the organization. What is the critical gap within the organization for which this program or the process it is not getting this is desired results. Now we will we'll, that is another step, another step that should be done. So that's another step. We'll do that. We'll work out, work on it. Because this is not the uh, everything cannot happen in two day workshop, na? Okay. Tomorrow there is an interesting session at ten thirty on project development. So you should attend that, Pradeep. <laughs> there is certainly, certainly, but the same link or beginner arts? Same link. The same, same, same link. link. Uh, project, project design. Is, 
sir it is the is the same link same same link same link same link sir okay then then it's, no this it, it is suddenly i received this mail because it's, I, it it it's just 30 minutes 30 minutes before to, to opening the mail because i i, I never had this or the, i didn't get it earlier huh today this is the, this is suddenly i got this message uh, mail at, uh, then i opened it today i sent a calendar remi reminder no yesterday no 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 it, it has not sent earlier even if yesterday anyway i don't want to no 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 it is, it's a good option because this... she has been put on the mat several times today jamuna sir ke dash mein Huh? Okay, sir, so, thank you. 